Well, let's go. Let's go. Tail weapon only run. As you can see, I've begun as a thief so I can have the master key, but also... Wow. Start with 10 black fire bombs. So I don't even need to use a weapon on Asylum Demon. Gibba! Three months. Resubbed. Three days. Till Elden Ring. Dual wield tails, that way you always have two tails. Define dual wield. By dual wield, you mean just put it in your left hand and never use it, right? Because... Yeah, sounds right. <clears throat> what? What? I missed. Pretty good damage, huh? Goodbye. What? I'm so used to grabbing this bonfire now because it's zero hit league, but whatever, I'll grab it. Taurus Demon Tail Run. What now? Who? Ah, ow! Gate closed for Lobos. Get, let me go, though. Right. Hello, Fear Wars. How are you? Tomorrow is Super Cat Day? Super Cat Day. Is that a national holiday? I hope so. Whose tail we getting first? That's a good question. Um, if I'm doing a use what tail you see, uh, that might be... Let's see, that might be the first one that we can get. What else would there be? Gargoyles, but not until Anorlando or the boss fight. Um, but if I'm gonna get other tails, it's probably a good idea to have a good weapon, which probably means... Why am I going here? I don't need to go here. This probably means uh, Hellkite Drake then. Yeah. Get that Oscar tail. So, uh, we decided after months and months of not really deciding, I just decided finally <clears throat> for Elden Ring launch, we're going to do... Subscriber only chat, slow mode, followers only mode, 10 minutes. Because there's going to be a lot of stuff happening. And we're also going to be on the front page, at In least for a while. Legends, it is dated. How slow? I don't know, it's like one message every... Uh... Well, do we want... Do we need slow mode? You think sub overwrites follower... Hmm. Really? So somebody could subscribe immediately and start talking, though? I Oh, and the other part is that I'm not really going to look at chat very much. So don't worry too much about me being spoiled. I may look at chat occasionally when something crazy happens or uh, if I'm actually trying to remember a detail or something like that, you know. It'll be there. I'm not just turning it off, but it'll be there. Yes, everything will be off of the stream. There will be no chat. There will be no notifications. No, no nothing. No nothing. It'll be empty, just me and video game. No Elden Ring countdown timer. Uh, T Max, T Max, 61 months. Welcome back. Knee mug, 29 months. Account up timer? Hmm. I have not, Walrus Pug. I sit here twiddling my thumbs. What is that? X Lawson. Thank you for continuing that gifted sub. How will we know when it comes out? I know, I don't. That's just something we gotta live with, guys. I'm sorry. All right. 
So, first things first. <clears throat> uh, I need to think about... So, I haven't thought about this run at all. Um, I need a way to get Hellkite Drake's tail, right? You used to be able to do it with just the bow under the bridge. I think they, they changed that. If I'm not mistaken. I, I, and I can't use a bow because that's not a tail weapon, right? So I guess I could, I'll have to use items? Items? Um, still can, really? I thought he would fly away. Maybe not. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> we can get the... Uh, the, the ancient dragon's great sword. Everlasting dragon, excuse me. Not ancient. Um, the question is, can I get enough strength to wield that, even? And... Okay. <laughs> so. It takes like 50 strength, yes. But uh, what I'm doing right now is I'm collecting souls. And... Uh, I should have picked deprived or something. I am Beeb. Thanks for 14 months. Welcome back. Uh, 50 strength to one hand. To two hand, I think we would need something like 38. I think it's like 54 strength. To one hand. Uh, 34 for two hand? Okay. That's not too bad. <clears throat> the funny thing is that... Because of the way I'm doing the tail run, I'm doing a use what tail you see run. So if I do that, all of those stats, uh, I'll get all those stats, I'll get the amazing weapon, and then I'll cut off another tail and immediately swap off. So is there something better we can do? I can get free souls by killing Taurus. Um, I'm going to play Elden Ring as soon as I am able to, second shall I. Dual wield and must use both. Oh, okay. Yeah, the Drake. If I get enough fire bombs... Uh, where, hold on. Black fire bombs aren't until sins, right? But we could send skip. We could send gate skip. Oh, 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 Came down here, got souls. There, there are more souls and stuff on the way to... I'm going to save the Everlasting Dragon Tail. I don't want to get that yet. So... You know what's going to be great is when we go into the DLC and kill Sanctuary Guardian. That's going to be really great. Because that's the best tale ever. No. <clears throat> Strength and Elder Ring like usual? Yeah, a light knight. Oh, oh. I think that'll be my official name for that sort of build is a light knight. Not a night light, but a light night. Don't you dare. Don't. Okay. Light night. Get the gar gargoyle tail first and use that to get the Drake sword. Um. Yeah, I guess it's just a question of which one would be easier to get first. I could probably get the gargoyle tail really easily. Uh, the nice thing about Gargoyle Tail is I can also reset it, like, if I mess up and deal too much damage. I was thinking about that with the, uh, if I was using the Dragon Greatsword, and I accidentally missed the tail and, like, one-shot the Gargoyle or something, then I could just save and quit and redo it. I, yeah, I will need to end for Moonlight Sword down the line, but we can do him really late, and then by that point we'll have a lot of souls. I did eat my Elden Ring chocolates. There's a couple left. They're good. It was a pretty dark chocolate. 
Um, I do prefer milk chocolate just because I have an immense sweet tooth. Um, but I get on with dark chocolate just fine. Uh, <clears throat> ah, soul here. Nice. Yeah. You know what? Let's try and do... Let's try and do gurgles. Wait, why am I here then? We can just go uh, around uh, to Valley of the Drakes. Came out of Blight Town and I just started autopiloting. Are you going to cut tail with that weapon? With, uh, well, I've got four more black fire bombs. That might be enough. That might just be enough. Mm -mm -mm. I have not heard back, Jurgi. So, they may just be staring at my message, giggling and cackling. Sharing it with the rest of the team and going, <laughs> <We can't. laughs> It's a lot of souls, actually. Uh, Light Knight? Wait, what? Light Bright? Bright? Can't see what's up. <clears throat> That's one step of logic to take, Ramus. Firebomb scale? Not very much. If at all. Um, in other Souls games, I think they do have a scale. I don't know that they even, They don't even have stats in this. So I don't think that's the case in Dark Souls 1, but I could be wrong. Oh, look at that quote from me. Let me just let us know we might be busy with unrelated business. Unrelated business. Is this an official hoodie? From the Bandai Namco man themselves. Yes. Yes. It's backwards, isn't it? Because I'm, yeah, I'm rotated. Yeah, right. Yeah, there's, yeah, consumable scale and with stats and Bloodborne. I think Dark Souls 2, do they? No? Hello. Um, I can use the shield. Just can't damage. Oh, I don't even have the stats for the shield. Boo! Oh, yeah. Excuse me. Ow, ow, that was a double move. Did I sit at this bone fire? Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think, did I? Oh yeah, I did, okay. <laughs> Good for me. Uh, oh, the bonk though, the bonk. All right, let's see here. Let's see here. What the? Okay. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. Almost there. There you go. Good boy. Black Knight Shield, huh? Hmm. Hmm. I did win my Omit League match. Um, the way that it looks, it's extraordinarily unlikely that I can come out on top of the Omit League. The only way that is possible for me to win is if, to, no, not tomorrow, Wednesday, I have a perfect zero hit full match and CBD both loses and gets zero gates. <laughs> That's the only way. So basically, it's a fight for second and third place between myself and Hob. So, uh, yeah. Even if I did perfectly, it isn't up to me. It'll be up to CBD. <clears throat> CBD got a lot of the... I technically have more wins than CBD, but CBD has gotten the two bonus points um, for at least number of hits on a day several times. And so that has put him on top. Don Wheezy, six months. Welcome back. My Valheim hardcore run. Uh, 
Yeah, I remember when that happened. Let's see. I could go grab the firebombs from uh, Firelink as well. Just as a... I probably need more strength for... Yeah, for Gargoyle Tail Axe. Got a lot of decks. Will they give Aaron a tie against CBD? He had it, but Hob started time or too early. No, I think they've been reviewing that and that was not the case. But there are several times that things like that have happened during the season and I think they're discussing whether they're going to like retroactively change the decision for all of those things. Uh, if it were me, it would not even be a question. Shit happens. The rules are there and maybe change them for the future, but not in the middle of the season. But it is Hobbs League and what happens happens. The board guy, 14 months. Welcome back. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Is there anything for me back in the asylum? Uh, I don't think so. Excuse me. Fire bomb. Okay. Time to get a tail with fire bombs. Let's see how that goes, huh? Should be no problem, right? I mean, fire bombs deal decent damage. And the tail doesn't need a whole lot of it. Well, it's going to be hard to hit the, the tail, I guess. Mm, I'm going to have to wait for the right attacks. Hello, Wolfric Svorkson. How are you doing? Elven Ring, no hit league starts next week. Get ready. Ask nicely for the tail. Okay. I got fire. Keep her soul, but I didn't turn it in. Hey, guys. What's up? Hello. Hello. I said hello. Please don't block me. 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 Nice. Hi guys. Dude, the channel doesn't even know I'm here. What a... Is the channeler asleep? <sighs> oh, there he goes. All right. <clears throat> All right, let's just see how this is gonna go. Oh wait, I have enough strength. You found today's a holiday and you don't have to work today. Isn't that the best feeling? Like you get up for something and you're like, all right, let's go. And then you don't have to. Thank you, what, just consumables. You still work today. I'm sorry, Buxton. Yeah, you're a gargoyle. <laughs> what? Okay, that was easy as shit. Nice. Oh, mid-roll. Fuck that. Hard game. Hard game. Excuse me. Just gonna black firebomb. Bye. <laughs> Easy as... Tailgate of my life. Sorry, mate. Oh. Uh, ooh, that's rough. That's rough. Oh, that's rough. Oh, that's rough. Oh, that's rough. Oh, that's a rough one. Don't. That's a rough. I mean, I don't really care about the kill anymore. It doesn't matter that much. But... Breathe your fire. Yeah, that's fine. Gate closed. That's just gonna. I have to. Lo I have to live with that for like the next ten years, don't I? Anytime I get hit anywhere. Ah. Okay, close. <laughs> Pogarithmic five months. Welcome back. Daedalus fifty-eight. Loading happiness nine months. Cannibal board guy. Look at all these resubs. Final weapon go of this run. Whatever I end up with. Crone, Don Weezy, Moslem Priest, Cryptid, Architect, Zodri, RT Sax, Touch of the Gamer, True Turkey, Beeb, Rudon, Craig, 
Nima, Gibba. I think I'm caught up now. What's my favorite tail weapon? Drake Sword. So, what I'm doing with this run is basically doing a use what tail you see run. Kind of. So, if I kill, or if I encounter, oh my god, dead ass. Oh, that's some pants, never mind. If I encounter an enemy that has a tail weapon, I get the tail, and I use the tail. And I dodge to the left and dodge to the right. Gotta cut all the tails, that's right. So, that means, as I encounter tail bosses in order, I will need to grab them and forcibly discard my previous tail weapon. Which, um... Priscilla's tail or Sanctuary Guardian first? Uh, Sanctuary Guardian's tail is awful, but what I am tentatively planning on doing is to use it anyways to kill Artorius, then unlock Calamite, get the tail with his tail, and then finish out. Then I'm again. It's it's a it's a very garbage weapon. It will be suffrage. It will be a lot of suffering. But I want to do it. All right, because I could I could keep Priscilla in my back pocket, or I could uh, you know leave some enemy somewhere and be like, all right, I'll come back for that when I need it. But that would be. That would be cowardly. 24 strength. Oh, I should level up this weapon. Can Guardian Tail even get Calamite Tail? If it can deal damage, then yes. Absolutely. Yeah, the question is, should I... <sighs> yeah, I should go get, uh, I guess, Drake Sword now. Well, you must be a neighbor, Ron. <clears throat> eh, that's not gonna do me good, is it? Ah, uh, it's 200. Okay. Yeah, I can buy one more and upgrade still. Oi! Oi! Stallion MVP and Saint. One Nick. Welcome back. Hyped about another Souls type game. Me too. Fun to be able to help or hinder your challenge runs because it's cross platform. Hey. Wait, really? The online is cross platform for Elden Ring? Are you joking? Can I switch between the weapons if you get them? No. No, it's not. Yeah, oh, okay. Are you sure it's not? And we're sure it. Yeah, wait, what? Cross-platform. I don't think cross-platform is... That word. You keep using that word. I do not think it means what you think it means. Yeah. I, I, uh, it is on multiple platforms, but it's not cross-platform. I don't um, usually pay attention to online features. But... A lot of other people do, and I think I trust them. Um, Ice Cold X, thank you for the sub. Welcome to the Wolf Pack. Let's see. Halkite? Should I do bosses in a... Some sort of standard order? Because Gaping Dragon is down there as well. But I don't really have the stats to use it. So, like, I guess I'll do it based off when I actually have the stats. I would like to use Dragon King Great Axe. It's a beefy weapon. Oh, yeah. It's so different, like, knowing what enemy is going to be where. You know, it's... When's the last time I did Dark Souls with non-randomized enemies? Been a while. I guess we did that Lobos SFX test or something. That was a while ago. I will go for all bosses, yeah. 
<laughs> I also half expected that fog gate to teleport me. Ah! Gate closed. For Perpetuation. Ow. Rude. Hi. Weapon's got some reach. Did you hear there's a new Atlas RPG coming August? I did not. I did not. My Christmas miracle run. That's true. That was like two months ago. That's still a long time, I feel like. Oops. <clears throat> Turtle? You mean turtoys? What do you mean what's Atlas? Oh. Yeah. What class you're going to start as an Elden Ring? I don't know what classes exist. No. I do not. Light Knight. Light Knight. That is the, uh... That is the the build type that I will go for. Light Knight. Oh! Oh, that's not a Mimic. Why do I think that's a Mimic? <laughs> uh. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Remaster saves his life! It was in a mod once. What was in a mod? Naked by a guy with big sword. No, I, no, that would be naked knight. All right. Light knight means I prioritize my weapons and a good shield. And then beyond that, whatever armor I can wear that either is, you know, well, good protection or uh, swag fashion that is a concern light armored knight exactly light knight that's what that means unless I am relegated from season one yes I will be participating in season two which will be Dark Souls 3 which will be interesting all right, let's have this boy jump off though. Just to just to say that we could have you know, we could have gone this way without a tail weapon gotten some extra souls. Come here. One more. Uh-oh. He didn't do it. There you go. Now, Hellkite Dragon Tail. So I mentioned that you're in danger of going versus the lowest place in Rally Zone. I don't understand how. So there is a... There is one match that is um, kind of separate from the whole league thing. And that is when all the uh, places are set on the leaderboard, the person in the eighth slot, which is the closest, the least bat, least relegated slot, um, goes up against the person in with the least hits from first to seventh place. Whoever has the most number of hits from first to seventh has to defend themselves against the eighth place. If the first to seventh place person loses, then they are out and the eighth person, eighth place person saves themselves. Oops. So, as it stands, I have the third most hits in the first to seventh place 
But there's a possibility that Dino, who, well, and also matters how many hits we get on the next day. So there's a lot of things that could be happening. We'll see. How is that fair? It's, it's fair if it's the rules. It is all about zero. It's called zero hit league, man. So the hits matter. What if that's you though? Then that's fine. If I don't do Dark Souls three, that's fine. I don't mind. I don't mind being not in season two. Oh. Oh shit! Hold on. Reset. I meant to. Where's my gold pine resin, baby? You do mind? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. More time for Elden Ring. Well, season two does not begin for two months after Elden Ring's launch. Two months. Are you, did you leave? Are you back? Oh yeah, okay, here we go. Ah! Yeah! <clears throat> Hellkite sees me. Zappy. Okay, whatever, dude. Huh? Hmm. 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 The manipulation might be off because I already let him drop down once and then didn't do anything. Let me reset. Chuso gets in the sound plates. Hyakujin drops to bottom three. It's either you or Dino in the relegation match. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh. Yeah, and it doesn't mean that I'm straight out. It's still a match, right? I still play against somebody. Um, you're going to glitch him through the bridge. No, no. Patched what? I'm not doing any glitches. What are you talking about? Oh, I haven't done Endwalker yet, Lurch. What the fuck? He's glitching! That's the thing where he starts walking and then you if you move out, he teleports back up onto the... Okay. You're not glitching. He's glitching. Yeah, what the fuck? D-patch. You've never seen that in your life? Well, if it happens again, I'll show you exactly what... It... It's fucking weird. He'll start walking, and then you're like, oh, well, he's down, so I'm going to run out. And then as soon as he sees you, he'll whoop back up onto his perch and then breathe fire. And you're like, what the fuck? Thank you. Kuremoa! Ooh. Okay, so now I've gotten the, dr the Drake Sword. That means I have to say adios. Adios, Gargoyle Tail Axe. Dispose of it. Goodbye. I'll drop other things just to clear inventory space. Sorry, Claymore. I love you, but not this time. Maybe Black Knight Shield. So now we have plus zero Drake Sword. Rip Tail Axe. So, gargoyles are dead. Now we can continue business as usual. Um, I could do Capra right now, but again, I don't want to go to Gaping Dragon until I have a decent amount of stats to wield the Dragon King Great Axe. Pazifista 69. 88 months. So instead, I'm going to go down to Blighttown and we're going to do Quellad, yeah? Same goes for the Everlasting Dragon Tail. Cut Capra's tail. Hmm. Mm hmm. Oh. How do you decide which tail weapon to get next? I don't really. I mean, 
based on where I'm going. I'm gonna go do Quellag just because I'm I'm gonna progress the game. And Um I guess the next tale we'll see is also the gargoyle tail axe in Anorlando. There's two of them, so Hooray. Let's upgrade our Estus. <clears throat> Check this out. No, that's not what I wanted to do, you idiot. <laughs> you leave me no. You dead. Is that about which character you'll play? Are you thinking the strength build? Light knight. Light knight. Oh wait a minute. I didn't I didn't get the freaking ring. I'll bring it back. I didn't want his ring. Yep. Yeah, we can do Seath late, make sure we have enough stats for the Moonlight Greatsword so that we can use it. The one thing that I don't want to do, I want to, I don't want to... A, I don't actually want to, and B, I don't want it to seem like I am copping out and immediately tossing away an improper weapon for something else. So, like, by the time I get to Seath... Like, I'll probably do the strong weapons. Strong tail weapons before Seath. Uh, by those, I mean Dragon King Great Axe and or Everlasting Dragon's Great Sword. Um, then I could do Seath. And then we could, like, finish Gwyn with Moonlight Great Sword or something. That would be cool. Hell, I don't even remember the last time I've used Moonlight Greatsword in this game. I remember the last time I got it, though, and it was very recently. That'll make sense later. Uh, but down to Blight Town for now. When my greatsword in Dark Souls 1 feels very special for some reason. I kind of feel that way about Demon Souls. Um, oh god, and especially the, the way they made it look in the Demon Souls remake. <laughs> Slim Jatim! Ah, still got it, baby. Been a while since I did that bad boy. Whoa! <laughs> ah! Slim Jatim, six months. Welcome back. Caladrios, five months. Ah, don't retry to log in. MLGs and Medivas? Absolutely! Absolutely! It's from Kingsfield. Oh, God. Okay, nice. What's now not allowed in the league? To save and quit? No, you cannot save and quit in the league. Um, so if I go down and get the great the dragon greatsword right now, I don't have the stats to wield it, so that sucks. How many how many souls do I have here? Yeah, not many. My least favorite thing about Drake Sword is because it doesn't scale with strength, you don't get any benefit in two-handing it, except for the move set. You're not gonna get any damage bonus. <clears throat> mm. 
Doodly -doo. I did do all the pictures. Much like Kingsfield made me want to play Eternal Ring for the first time, and you're loving it. Nice. I'm glad. Yeah, Sanctuary Guardian weapon I will use. I will use against Artorias. Then I will get Calamite's Tail, and and uh, that will be a a section of suffering. But I see I see that as one of the uh, probably only challenging parts of this run. You can buff all the tail weapons. I don't know that you can buff. You, know, you can buff. Well, you can buff uh, Gargle Tail Axe. You can buff. You might be able to buff uh, the Scorpion Tail. Uh, Guardian Tail Whip. I think, I think you can. You can buff a lot of things. You can't buff Drake Sword. You can't buff... Maybe you can buff Dragon King Great X? If there are n normal upgrade weapons, you can buff them. Can't... You can buff Calamites? Well, I cannot buff Great Sword. Uh, Drake, Drake Sword. Okay, this is actually... It's not going to be great damage against Quellag. I'm going to try one-handing. We'll do this Dark Souls 3 style. Raw Broadsword. Colony Sail can be buffed. It's just a plus, we plus five weapon, right? A plus... Plus one? So panic rolling. Now, R1... One-handed R1 spamming. Hold on, is this true? Let's help that. Oh, wait, actually, no, you do do more damage two-handed, but you don't get the scaling bonus from strength. If it doesn't scale with strength, that makes sense. I just remembered it incorrectly. Stop it! But is it better DPS? That's the question. See, this is what I talk about when... When all the zero hit leaguers, you know, I mean, they're playing it safe, right? But this is like the way that I know how to do Quellag. Well, get away from the ramp, though. It's just sitting right in front of her face. Come here. And you get big time DPS, too, which is nice. Hi, Rhythm Code Gaming. I mean, too safe isn't a problem unless they're out of time. Then it is a problem. But also, you can get... If she jumps, you can get staggered. So it's kind of risky to be in her leg area. But if you move towards the front like that, then I think you, you're safe. Seems risky AF, but... Uh-oh, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Thank you. There you go. Okay, there's no tail there. No tail weapon, anyways. What did I lose HP to? Poison. I had poison going in. Is Sage Regarding Sail worth using? No! But I will have to because my rules are stating that if I encounter a tail boss, a tail weapon enemy, I have to get the tail and use it immediately. Well, I mean, not immediately. It's... I have to kill it and then I have to use that tail. What's up, Zen Desket? How are you doing? Um... Oh, I touched the bone fire in Blighttown. I might as well get this one. Oh, wait. Where am I going? No. Hmph, but you have no eggs. If you get poisoned by an enemy, yes, it absolutely counts. If you get poisoned by Blighttown, no, that does not count as a hit. 
No, that's the thing that I don't want to do. I don't want to save weapons and then just skip bad weapons that way. That's the last thing that I would like to do. So I will be getting the, the Guardian Tail Whip and then killing Artorius with it. And then getting Calamite's Tail with it. Sorry. Look at look in a mirror, dude. Who's the monster here? This is a lot of like egg material too. I never really thought about how much web and egg shit came out of both her and Quella. And who who got her pregnant? Who is the father of all these egg children that are happening? And who exactly hops out of the eggs? Is it the chaos bugs? I gotta start thinking in a lore capacity so that when I encounter things in Elden Ring, we're asking the right questions. Oh, that spy... spy dussy? The spussy? Oh, God. <clears throat> Don't... These are the right questions to ask. Pinwheel tail weapon. Parthenogenesis, female reproducing alone. Um, is there a spider species that does that? I don't know. Have you already thought of your Elden Ring build? <laughs> light Knight! Every time I say Light Knight, take a shot. Light Knight. Fuck, you woke up, you set your alarm clock for Friday. Oh. Brutal. Sorry about that. You're already blacked out. Well, light night. Okay, so Ceaseless definitely banged Quellag's sister. That's what's happened here. Maybe he, maybe it's like, there's no, there's no intercourse. There's just like spores and ceaseless just like pfft, spores all into the air. I don't know. Yeah, are you, are you saying that because it's her brother that that wouldn't happen? I'm confused. Are you? Are you, you really think that that's not something that would happen in a Souls game? Incest of all things? I mean, Lothric twins, for God's sake. Come on. Come on. <laughs> what, are you, what kind of game director do you think we have here? Ahem. <clears throat> Soul's lore is wild. Okay, let's keep going with the strength. Okay, let me think about things coming up. Wait, 34 is, I think, probably enough to two-hand. Yeah. Dragon Greatsword? Is it 30? Yeah, 34, I think, is right. Nah, Int is going to be way later. So, if I go get that right now, and then I kill Havel... Uh, for the, just for the, uh, equip load, we've got Fap Ring, and we're in the area. That, actually, that works. Let's do that. Let's do that. What kind of ring-shaped snacks should you get for Elden Ring launch? Oh, definitely the, like, the, the gummy, like, peach gummies, the O's, right? Like, are those trolley? You should also get some like donuts or um, like the 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 crunchy donuts, the crunchy donut donuts. Oof. 
eat Cheerios for breakfast. I had Cheerios for breakfast today, actually. Dried apples. Yeah, don't talk, don't say onion rings in this chat, please. You had toast. Did you put a hole in it? Did you stick your dick? Uh, hey, Blight Town. Let's large Titanite shard. I wonder how much we're actually gonna upgrade in this run. I don't think I'm gonna upgrade the Dragon Greatsword. That's for sure. Because we'll probably swap it. Probably swap it quickly. And oh, I meant to put on this gear. Yeah. Oh no, man. Nah. Really? Take the pants off. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Drake Sword already losing its momentum. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, that's how it goes. The worst weapon used in a challenge run. Uh. Worst weapon? A straight sword hilt is the worst weapon. But you can buff it and you can put crystal magic weapon and it's actually not that bad, I guess. If you can't buff Guardian Tail Whip, that weapon is awful. It's just absolutely awful. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I know it's just anatomically how leeches are, but... I, I tweeted the other day because I, I was... Ah, spoilers. I was playing with leech corpses. Okay, I'm gonna die. And I found their mouths. Give me your stupid mouth. Come here. Get out of here, you stupid fire bees. Regular bees. Yeah! What is a... Oh. Get. Yeah. Thank you. No, where's your mouth? Their teeth. Teeth. There. Teeth. But the reason that I was like, whoa, that's weird, is because specifically in Dark Souls, right, they come at you wide side first, right? Like, I don't know how leeches move around in real life. Do they just float until they attack? Are they like bacteria and they just wait? I'm sure they f swim around. Do they swim ass first? They've got to... They, they yeah. They swim. Do they swim with their mouth side front, though? Do they have eyes? I'll get this. 20 humanities. Any leech experts in the chat? They wiggle mouth first. Actually, they have teeth in their anus. Okay. Well. Dark Souls leeches going ass first is weird. That's what I was going to say, but I... That's why it was weird. Not, like, if somebody told me about Leech's anatomy outside of this, I would be like, oh, that's cool. Like, interesting. Which, I mean, I guess what I did here as well. But. It was weird because how the creature is designed and... Fuck. Designed and fuck. Damn, 60 FPS. Just kidding. Yeah, they have a suction side. I've learned this now. People linked me, like, scientific leech articles. Uh, <clears throat> they've got a suction side, and then they've got the mouth side. So they hold on, and then they bite. And, uh, well, I guess they double suck, really. <laughs> they just double suck. But, anyways, um... Uh... uh That's it. One of the three good rings in DS1? That's right. We're not going to use it for very long because we're going to get Havels and then use a very heavy weapon. Heavy weapon. Why is this so weird to me where I'm going and what I'm doing? Uh, 
who cares? Let's go here. What the fu- I have never been there in my life. That's a cool spot. Uh, hashtag ads seven up. Calamity ring. Oh, yeah. Dan SPG, Hosey Mina, Bergsy Madgun, Hobbit Foot D squared. Are you gonna? Okay. Thank you all for your rescrubbing. We're going down to get that everlasting dragon tail. This is where I want to go. I did play Neo 2. I liked it considerably more than Neo 1. Wait, what the? Oh, I thought it was mid-rolling for a second. Uh, we can just hop down, right? Yeah. Hey! Oh, no plunge. Plunge ignored. Large soul of a nameless soldier. You know, if there's not... If there's not souls like that in Elden Ring, we're gonna have to come up with all new jingles, huh? But if there's a soul of a brave warrior. I will experience pleasure live on stream. Get out of here. Found a new spot in Sekiro this week with two spear monks and a bulging coin pouch in Hirata. Two spear monks and a bulging. Mm. Oh. It still does the thing in Remastered, right? That is the T theme song, basically. T. 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 It was opposite the entrance cave to the Harada Palace. The Harada Palace, where you go inside and then you fight Lady Butterfly. Why does that happen? Camera, the trigger, I'm sure the zones are based on the camera, not the player position. So adjusting the camera changes it. This is my guess. I can't envision where the spear monks um, would be. Raise your hand if you've never seen the Hyder jump. This could be a first for you. Learn some new things every day. Free Willy. Free Willy! Holy shit! Whee! Oh, I should get some Dragon Skulls for upgrades. You've never seen that. Good, good. There's always somebody who hasn't seen these things, so I'm saving quitting. Reset the Hydra. <laughs> 14, thanks for 23 months. Almost two years. That's right. That's absolutely normal for Hydra. <laughs> if you're running through and you don't kill it, it's got to catch up to you, and that's how it catches up to you. By leaping over. That... Those are the sorts of things I really love and cherish about Dark Souls. There's always little details. This a wealth of knowledge to be had. Yeah, it chases you. It's gonna do it again. There he goes. He just did it again. It's never done that, and you just run past. Well, you never looked at it then. He absolutely does that every single time if you just run past. Every time. 100%. Yeah, I wouldn't jump. <laughs> the Pog Champs. Oi! 
It's an impressive leap, really. How does that much mass... What kind of... There's like no... Oh my god! It's a right proper yeet. Okay! So the whole reason we're down here is to really quickly just go, Hey, we get the Dragon Great Sword. Tail. I love the the openness of Dark Souls 1, yep. From the get-go, you can you can go face any of like 13 bosses. That's with glitches, but still, you can. From leaving the asylum, it's like you have so many options. Slap, slap. Nope, gaping's not done yet. Dragon Drake Drard. Goodbye. Mm. The map of Dark Souls is very nicely connected. Let me show you. I'm, a lot of people are familiar with it, but again, some people do not know. One sec. This nice piece of art. God, I have a terrible memory, so if you guys want to get me the the name of the creator um, to give them credit. I suck with names, I'm just horrible. But I have this poster and I'm gonna hang it soon. I've had it for a while. It's a vertical map that shows, ah, the green. The layout of Dark Souls. Ooh, is it TEDx? Is it TEDx, I think? Meow. Ooh, it's an awesome art piece. Um, this was off Fangamer, so if you wanna, I don't know if they still have it on there. That's really awesome. And it's a nice long poster, which is a cool shape. So I gotta get myself a long frame. Tedx sounds familiar, but I might be completely wrong about that. <clears throat> Whoop. Slip it in my tube. <laughs> Wall scroll. Let me see. You can probably just go fangamer.com, maybe. Dark Souls. There it is. Boom. Easy. Law Date Solace by Judson Cohen, a.k.a. Tetix. Boom. Brain still got it. Still got it. <clears throat> yeah. Go support that awesome work. There you go. Law Date Solace. Fangamer. Boom. 36 bucks. It's great quality. Good art. Go get it. Are there also ones for various Zeldas? I don't know. Maybe he's got more stuff. I do have a brain still for now. Which is good for um, Elden Ring because... Oh, wait. Hold on. Get rid of Drek Sward. And now I may have to painfully mid-roll all the way out of... Oh, my God. Wait. Yeah, that's better. All right. And... Nah, there's no way that's gonna... No, no. We're not fat rolling through Blighttown, that's for sure. He did the Rogue Legacy music too? What? That's bizarre. That's that's such a... What a man of many talents. Your old brain has developed to the point where it can't be Ishin. It's the worst. Hmm. Hmm. I believe that you can. You may just have a mental block right now. It's easy to get stuck in a a way of thinking that uh, makes you think you can. You can do it, though. It looks like the Fumal Tree Greatsword. Uh, yeah, yeah, it does. It does. Done it. Done it. This sword is uh, one of the highest attack rating weapons in the game. Um, the highest being a crystal... Demon Great Hammer, I believe. Which is a lot. <laughs> max max level crystal demon great hammer. Wait, did Great Axe. You're right, you're right, you're right. Axe. Yeah, it's the one off Taurus. Not the one off Asylum Demon. Yeah, Axe. Crystal Demon Great Axe. I never use those weapons, so. They're kind of in the same place in my mind. Uh, look at this. 
Slap. That's unupgraded with very little scaling. Oh, it doesn't have scaling. Oh, well, that's even better for us, I guess, with lower stats. No! That's okay. We just got to escape out of here. So I'm going to use the axe many times? I don't know about many times. Certainly not relative to times I've used other weapons. <laughs> but I probably use it quite a few times, yeah. The heavy attack on this sword is great. Haha, <laughs> great sword. <laughs> and then there's the weapon that I feel like is very unused, which is the Capra weapon. The Demon Great Machete. At least I rarely ever use that. Harder to find, too. You just gotta find, farm it off the Capras. The Kappa weapon. I got up to like 466 item level last night. I did a lot of gear gearing up in Lost Ark last night. Whee! Splat! Or with four... I might be 480. Can I eight bosses you can access after Asylum without killing a boss? Did you include... Glitches? Let me see. Hold on. We'll we'll talk through it. I, my number may be... Again, I doubt my brain in many situations, but we'll see what happens. You'll do an abyssal with me? I did the first two abyssals. Those were really cool. This first one seemed like... Very easy. And then the second one had mechanics very much so for both boss fights. And I was like, oh, <laughs> have to pay attention and do stuff. Absolutely. All bosses. So Priscilla included... Um, which means getting her tail as well. Which can be tough, because it's very easy to accidentally kill her without getting the tail. The OG Rain. Thank you for four months. Welcome back. Beep, beep, boop, beep, beep. Have I played Neverwinter? Neverwinter Nights? Never- oh, Neverwinter's an MMO, right? No. You can hit her tail before she aggroes. If you aim it correctly, you can get the tail cut when she's still, uh, visible. But you can also stagger her very quickly and make her visible. It's just a bit harder after that point. I would say I I will probably have a harder time getting Priscilla's tail than Seath's uh, Seath's tail. Seath's tail. Um. Hmm. Although if you mess up Seath's tail the first time, it can be really rough. As long as you have a good enough weapon, you should be fine though. We'll Seath about that. True. Yeah, there's a fluffy tail. See, this easy... Well, at least... The strategy that I use is just a one-time. Like, you can only do it one time. It's easy, but it's also... If you fuck it up, like, then you, you miss that opportunity. And then you just have to kind of, like... I don't know. I don't, I don't have to do a backup strat very much because it is easy. But now that I'm talking about it and mentioning it... Like, I could see myself... Just, uh... Fucking it up a bunch. But we'll see. Not we didn't do Calamite yet. Uh, the cool thing about this great sword is look at the block on this. Ready? Okay, well, it's very high stability, anyways. Crunch. Hey, it's like seventy percent fizz block though, which is almost as good as some shields. I feel. It's mid roll. This sword has better blocking than most of the shit. Well, I don't know. It's 70. No, most shields have like 80, 90. Uh, and then there's hundos. I, don't, I wouldn't say most shields. Wessie Jills. Six months. Welcome back. Uh, you can essentially fail first tries just to show off. Well, that wouldn't be showing off. That would be flailing like a dead fish out of water. Not a dead fish, wait. 
flailing like a fish out of water. That's what I was going for. Uh, what was I going to do here? Oh. Uh. Yeah. Havel. Yes, I've done consumables only. All bosses. If you'd like to, you can go watch my 43-minute fight against Manus. Where I had to hit, like... 60% of my throwing knives. I had to hit him in the head for counter hit damage. It's bad. It's really bad. I had to use 99 black fire bombs, 99 regular fire bombs, all of my poison throwing knives. And then I think when uh, I think we still had maybe like 50 throwing knives left. But I got really good at free aim throwing knifing. Where am I going? I'm in the watchtower. Manus in the face. I think it also stuns him? No, no, no. It wouldn't stun him. You could do a full cheese that way. Oh, yeah. Here, ready? Hold up. Hey, <laughs> Unnecessary, but worth. 99 firebombs. But a tail ain't one. Well, that that's true. Did you ever hear something useful from chat? Hmm. Uh, yes. Chat is a hive mind of knowledge, both useful and useless, correct and incorrect, interesting and wholly uninteresting. You're the useful part? Uh, wait, <laughs> who, who are you? Let's go. Think it's a little build, well... Thing in Elden Ring through... Oh, anyways. Bet you say that to all the chats. All the chats? Good night, Havel. Now? Eeeeh! <laughs> Alright. Time to level endurance. Just a little bit. I mean... It's not a big deal. So we can go to Sins now. We can do Capra. We could go to Gaping. I'll get a little bit more Endurance, I think. We can head to Anorlando. We can trade out the Gargoyle Tail Axe in, uh, for the Dragon Great Sword. Our knowledge isn't incorrect. We know alternative facts. Uh huh. Hmm. Well, we're swapping off this weapon pretty quickly. This is, if you're just joining us recently, I'm doing this essentially as a... A use what tail you see run. So as I encounter the enemies that have tail cuts, I do them and then I swap forcibly to the new weapon and discard the old. So, But I don't want to do it such that I, you know... I could have left the Dragon Greatsword for a situation where I got in trouble with a bad weapon and then just, you know, cheesily gone and gotten the, the Greatsword at that point. Um, I want to legitimately make use of Tails for a while. Yes, exactly. So the worst part of this run will be DLC. Sanctuary Guardian Tail. I will be grabbing that. I will be fighting Artorius, and then I will cut the tail off of Calamit with that awful, awful weapon. That horrible garbage bag weapon. But it'll be fine. Also, I could use some Artorius practice, apparently, considering I didn't no-hit him twice in a row. Both times, I took one hit, and that's just un uh, unacceptable. Entirely unacceptable. Wait, you're supposed to... There you go. Holy shit. Bye. It's gonna be the final tale? I think I'm gonna leave it to Seath's uh, Moonlight Greatsword. 
And I'll use Moonlight Greatsword on Gwyn. Guardian Tail Whip, I can use, yeah, I can put... The thing is, even though the Guardian Tail Whip is enchantable, all the DLC weapons are magic resistant, so it's not going to help very much, if really at all. I mean, it, it is help, right? It's better than nothing, but... Oi! Double oi! Oi! Smash it! Still alive. Dead. <laughs> Sucker! No spoilers, because people may already know, but will we see... Limb cut weapons in Elden Ring. I am ignoring the chat now for the next 17 seconds. Please do not answer that question, or you will probably be timed out for a long time. I haven't gotten any vitality. You guys let me know if I accidentally pass up some tail. But I don't think I have it. Alright, it's been 17 seconds, so... Wow. That was kind of close. I have to pee, I'll be right back. Okay. Hyper Monkey! Thanks for 37 months. Welcome back. Skip what? Alright. You know... Hmm. Hmm. One second. So, yeah, here's the thing. I... <clears throat> I have not yet, but I know that some people have gotten codes for Elden Ring at this point. And, you know, GameStops are getting their copies. Is that something we should do something about? I don't like to exclude chatters. But is that something we should proactively combat? I mean, this, there's been spoilers, you know, since network test. At least follower mode for sure, though. Exclusive chat, that's right. <clears throat> I don't know. Banhammer, absolutely. The, the implication I was leaning toward would be more like um, sub only or honestly like 30 minute follower only now is like fine like I don't if you haven't been following for 30 minutes obviously you're new to the channel which is fine it sucks to be locked out but then it's also only 30 minutes and that blocks out people who are going to be like you know, channel hopping. Channel hopping with the spoilers, because that is a thing. <laughs> Whenever a new thing comes out, movie, game, any of that. This so last year has been a nightmare you managed to dodge all spoilers possible. I've only watched the first announcement trailer. Same. The one that we watched at the Game Awards. Oh, I didn't get the key. That is the one that I have watched. Ooh, what if we... Okay, I have an idea. 
Oh, but I'll need a lot of decks, right? For Priscilla's. Don't you dare do that. Yeah, you did it. I. Oh, Summer Game Fest is what it was? Whoopsies. Get wrecked, bro. Was it Summer Game Fest? The very first one that they showed gameplay. Remember? I remember that day like it was yesterday. I need to go get the key, actually. I expected as much from thee. Does he throw here? So that was the last piece of Elden Ring that I saw. Was the very first time they, they showed Elden Ring gameplay. Oh my god, you saw gameplay spoiled. Everything else, I like I think I see tweets and stuff and comments and I think like a couple of days ago they released a trailer. And then at some point they released a story trailer. And Vati Vidya is like, I played the final build of Elden Ring, come watch. And I'm like, <laughs> Get out! I'm not talking to Snake, not to Vadi. Vadi, please don't get out. You don't really believe in spoilers? Well, um, there are people who don't believe in many things that exist. Donation only chat. If I could, dude, if I could do something where like, Sub only, but all of my sub money goes to charity. I would do that so much more. So much more. All of the sub money during the sub only goes to charity. Like, because then it would be. I don't, I don't, the, I, my intent is never to do like sub only. To get that fat dough, you know. But if you do that for charity, then, I mean, I would, I would use that a lot more. That'd be nice. Maybe I'll talk to my Twitch man. See how that goes. Hello! Iron Jolem, huh? I'm gonna kill for Chunk? Chunk. Slap. Hello. Hey, careful. Uh oh. Blip. The mid roll, baby. Oh, the kick. <laughs> the chill. Alec Gearhart. Thanks for that prime sub. I appreciate you. This is not from a boss. This is actually from the Everlasting Dragon in Ash Lake. Three days less. It's even less than what it shows on that timer. Hold up. Hold up. Blah. Crunch. Cut his tail. Ba, 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 ba. Simple. Simple. Captain Frost, thank you for the four months. Welcome back. When do we get the rune golem? That sounds like a cool mod boss. Like just a fast, even if it was just like a sped up iron golem, but he like glowed blue and they called it rune golem. That would be cool. I don't know what rune golem is a reference to, but that sounds like a, a cool boss name. Are right, you going for Obby GS? Obby. Oh, Obsidian? Yes, absolutely. I'm, I'm pretty much going to get all the tails in the game. Um, so the next tails we got coming up are the two gargoyles in Anorlando. I need to make sure that I do not kill. Really need to make sure that I do not 
kill the gargoyle before I get its tail. Dark Soul 84. Thanks for the sub. Welcome to the wolf pack. That's still not enough. But. Oh, shit. Okay. If I do a fast roll past an overhead gargoyle slam or the side boy, I should have a good angle for a follow up on the tail. If I hit him once or twice, I will save and quit to prevent him from dying. Make sure we get all the tails. Hello. Pontiac, seven months. Yeah, this is good. Blah! Oh. This is good. No! Oh god. Okay, no, no, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I need to do like a running attack, is the thing. Nah, sir. No. 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 If you kill him, do you have to reset the run? I will not kill him. Whoa. That was nuts. No. What in this shark basket, dude? That scoop tail, that's the most dangerous attack he's got, man. What the? The scoop? Would you just... Okay, I'm resetting. I'm gonna start right next to him, too, when I load in, but... <clears throat> Reset it, yeah, yeah. After two hits, definitely resetting. Okay, try this again. Oh my god! Did you know it'd be badass? Are you kidding me, dude? Is if he did the tail attack? Son of a bitch. Fu fuck. Thank you. Goodbye, Dragon Great Sword. You've done me proud. But I leave you. Oh. I leave you, Gargoyle. Now that is the in the uh, everlasting dragon tail. Dragon Great Sword. But goodbye. It's been nice. Back to this old hunk of junk. Get some Demon Titanite in case we uh Wait, we won't actually be creating any boss weapons. Oh, wait. Demon Titanite for Priscilla's tail, right? I think. Maybe. So the rules, I'm essentially doing all the bosses, all the tail enemies in the game, and whenever I come across a, an enemy whose tail you can cut for a weapon, I cut their tail, and I immediately swap to that weapon. <clears throat> Discard whatever we were using up to this point. It's kind of like use what you see except only for tail weapons. Priscilla has a tail. We will get Priscilla's tail. In fact, I'm thinking we'll get it for uh, for ONS. That'll make things interesting, right? Does Smo bleed? I think it's got bleed on it, doesn't it? Now I have a garbage weapon for now, so... Okay, we're good, though. He does bleed. Okay. Ooh, you know what? I did not grab the doll. Oh, that's a lot of running back. I mean, it's, it's not a whole lot. I did get the cage key. Okay. Let's go get the doll. I want to do that, though. No, I have... I famously <laughs> have a song for getting Calamite's tail, and it's extremely consistent. All you have to do is bait out the swoop attack, and then you get guaranteed tail hits. Where the fuck did this gargoyle go? Get up. Okay. Calamite sale is easy mode. 
Now I have to get this guy's tail with a shitty version of his weapon. Hello? Come on, then. All right, you know what? I'm just going to stay close to you. And then maybe you'll do something good. Huh? Like maybe the shield punch. I missed. That's a bad one. All right. That's, that's the one that uh, somebody got hit by yesterday. Whoops. Okay, that's a tail hit. Whoops. Don't fall off! And if, if this guy fell off, it's not really a reset. We've already got the tail axe from the other one. This is more just... Kind of, um, I don't know. Semantics. He's gonna have lightning breath now, potentially. Eh. He doesn't drop one? Are you, really? Can he not t cut his tail? I don't kill these guys enough to know. Oh, oh he doesn't drop one. Interesting. Interesting. That's curious. You can only get two a game. Huh? Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! Wait, is he over there? Is he over here? Wait, maybe he's over there. Wait, what? Where'd he go? Where'd that guy? Oh, there's a gargoyle. Oh, another gargoyle. Gargoyle, stop. Okay, now we will back rack for the doll man I mentioned earlier too like is there anything for us in Asylum 2 and I didn't think about the painted doll I mean the peculiar doll for the painted world the painted peculiar dick stop this don't you dare sir don't you oh he's resetting Peculiar world. So come into peculiar world. Get out that I want you to do the gong. True Eiffel 65 fans, no. What year's that album? Like 1998 or some shit. <clears throat> Love the look of the gargoyle axe. This is, yeah, it's got the weird. It's so weird. This shit. Like, how are you gonna go from firm to floppy just like that? Imagine a world where Miyazaki collabed with Todd Howard. That'd be a. Mm. I mean, if he fixed up all the glitches. If Miyazaki quality controlled that shit. Firm to floppy. Ice water? Ow. Take clothes for Lobos! I don't want to touch any bonfires. No bonfiro. Wait a minute. I went past the cage, my bad. Paul W. Paul W. Let go of that tail, Lobos. It's dirty. No, it's clean. I licked it a bunch. First, I think it means I worked on a Castlevania game. That would be sick. You mean like in in the style of like Lords of Shadow, but but less kind of beat him up and more souls. Bear Zek, 20 months. Welcome back. Don't say but good. I didn't play Lords of Shadow 2. I like Lords of Shadow 1 though. I liked a lot. You cannot carry any more daggers. Oh. Yeah, I like the first one a lot. Dude, that one's crazy. I remember getting it just for the graphics alone. And then it's got really cool designs and stuff. Whee! What if Miyazaki and George R.R. Martin collaborated? What? 
Dude, that would be fucking crazy. There's no way it could live up to hype that... I'm gonna top off here. Legacy of Kane stream win. Probably 17 years from now. If I remember correctly, Lord Shadow 2 had a lot of stealth sections. Ugh. Ah, oh, yeah, Patrick Stewart. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, he does a lot of the voice stuff in uh, Lords of Shadow. That's awesome. Yes, I watched, unfortunately, all of Game of Thrones. I was so positive about it all the way through, too. Till the end, and then I was like... Get through. We're going through to the other side. Oh, Sir Patrick Stewart, excuse me. Fuck. Is the Patrick Stewart police coming to my house now? Wee woo. I did not watch Wheel of Time. <sighs> Game of Thrones was really good before it got more popular. But with anything that they're dumping a bunch of money to, they won't, I, don't, I don't even know what... I don't know. It's like the, they try to go for a more accessible story. Wait, do I gotta kill Stray Demon? Oh, no, I don't, actually. Not yet. Stray Demon has no tail. Never played Breath of Fire, nope. Season 3 was, like, fucking peak. Oh. Though I haven't- I have not rewatched the entire series in a, at all. It's been a long time. That's garbage damage. I'm out. <laughs> I did play Kuwan, yeah. Uh, maybe two years ago? Once I had no books to follow? I guess, yeah, I mean... Uh... Where am I going? This is not where I'm going. Oh. This is where I need to go. Here we go. Went the wrong way. You know what would make Game of Thrones season... Last season better? Is if they special guested Eiffel 65 for all the mute... <laughs> Sorry. I still got Eiffel 65 in my brain. House of Tabbies, 23 months! Welcome back! Watch this. I gotta make a speedy exit. Goodbye, stab over my head. Oh, no, no. Instead of Ed Sheeran. They have Ed Sheeran? Ooh, you know what? I should upgrade this weapon. We can do that at the Giant Blacksmith. Instead of Ed input from Miyazaki, AKA God. He's in the show. I don't remember that. I don't think I knew who Ed Sheeran was. When I watched Go... Uh, Game of Thrones. How do you dupe Homeward Bones while using one? Well, the way that I know to dupe is, requires Prepare to Die Edition and is not doable on Remastered. So, if you're asking about that, I mean, there's plenty of videos on YouTube on how to do it. But if you're playing a Remastered, don't worry. Mastodon guests appeared as corpses and that come back to life. I did not know that. That seems like unnecessary money, unless they just asked and they were like, "Yeah, man, I'll do that." I don't, I, I don't know anything about Mastodon band members, so I don't. That wasn't an impression or anything. Shed Eren. I actually, Ed Sheeran, Ed Sheeran, Ed Sheeran has a bunch of fucking bangers. It's uh, it's kind of unfair. Ah! Saved. H-boy. Oh, yeah. An MMO for what? That's also unfair. No, that was fair. I just fucked up. Ah, that's unfair! All right. Ah! <laughs> 
Wait a minute. My plan is to get the tail with this? Shit. <sighs> That's... Ooh. I don't even have any small... All right, hold on. Okay, I've got souls. That oh, that's gonna be a oh, that's a tough call. That'll be real tough. Yeah, Priscilla's tail is tough. If if you don't get it in one hit, damn it! I gotta backtrack again. Damn it! I mean, I could just kill ONS and we could do it later, but I feel committed to doing this now. Maicho, thank you for that prime sub. Welcome to the Wolfpack. Easier than Calamite with Guardian Tail? No, 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 no. Not for me, absolutely not. Because the Priscilla's thing is kind of like Seath to me. In that the way that I know to get the tail is you got the one chance. You know, when the boss is going to be set up a certain way. And then if you fail that, then you're kind of just blindly running around. Um, cage key. Cage key, uh, yeah. We're gonna go upgrade this bad boy. But now it would behoove me uh, to go get the large ember so we can have a plus 10 weapon. So, yeah, we're not doing Moonlight Graysword until late, and we'll have the int by then. So for now, we're gonna upgrade Diz. Yeah, I'll need decks, but I mean, we're, we're gonna get boss kills, right? And I've got boss souls. I am gonna use a boss soul for upgrading this weapon, though. Durkest Undered. 10 months. Welcome back. Elden Ring Hype Train. Hop on. Please have your ticket ready. Please have your ticket ready. Plus 10 resin and red tier center ring. Yeah, I was thinking about red tier center ring as well. I just don't... I don't know that I have a setup in the painted world for me to do that, but it's not like I you know, need to do it. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to touch any bonfires. What? Choo-choo! Vin Dolphin! Thanks for 500 bits. Michael Dubs. One year. I don't believe that tail would be dirty if you really did lick it. I mean, I know for a fact that's how Calamite cleans its tail for a fact. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. That's true. The archers are there. So, yeah, the chip damage would do nicely. Nine for an upgrade. For a plus five. Oh, no! Don't get, your Don't get yourself killed. If you're wondering, those resistance bars show up because you actually gain quite a bit of this resistance and so the the game increases your max but doesn't set it to zero so you have to let it drain out but hey the bleed resistance is going to be really nice for um priscilla with this weapon right so that's nice here's plus five see it happened again because i upgraded it replaces the weapon then you have to drain out those resistances but with all this equipment, now I could fast roll with all this on. Oh, beautiful. Oi! Oh, it is a design choice because if you swapped it and immediately cleared all of your, um, you know, bleed buildup and shit, that would be OP. That would be OP. And poison and toxic and that sort of thing. So... <clears throat> Oh, yeah, the shield's right before uh, Priscilla, the... Oh, man. This is, this is cool because we're actually making use of a lot of items that I would never really use. Um, and I think people like the idea of, you know, runs like this with tail weapons and that sort of thing. So I figured it would be a good one to redo for the YouTube because the original is long gone. Oi! Hey, boy. You're boring me. Oh, shit. You're boring. Oh, God. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
That boar butt box. Oh no, I touched a bonfire fart. Well. Rip. I wasn't, I didn't want to touch a bonfire. So once we got everything, we could just bone all the way back to Enerlando and be ready to go. But, well. Ah! Ah, uh, we already did the podcast episode and now it's missing a lot of it, Hatsune. So the FF1 run is kill. Especially with all the other things I've got going on. At least I got cage skip. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's true. So I just I bone back to that bonfire, run to the cage, and then we're back in Enderlando. It's not too bad. I just, you know. Dog. 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 Here we go. Say hello to my fire. Oh. Now that's what I call friendly fire. <laughs> uh, have I made that same joke for like the last seven years every time I come in this area? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. Oh. Well, well, well. <laughs> huh. What the dog doing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is this plus five? Yeah. All right. We're going to do Capra with plus five. No problem. We've got. Oh, yeah. That's right. I'm doing it. Eek! Oh. Ooh. Yay. Because he was standing on a well. <laughs> well, what is it? <laughs> Come on, dog. All right, let's see if my strats work. One, two, safe. Thank you, Zero Hit League. Oh, yeah. One, two, safe. Uh. Radon Wolf, five months, Elden Ring tail cut hype. Imagine if I cut a tail and Elden Ring dropped. Wait, where's my grass crest shield? Dude, I got the combo. Fuck. That blows ass. Don't you dare. Don't clip me. Don't clip me. Don't clip me. Oh, oh. Okay, cool. Where's my shield? There you go. Okay. I said, hey. Okay. Uh, okay. 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 No, I didn't almost die to Capra. I almost died to dogs, which are a much harder boss than Capra. Yep. Bye. Nice! Can you not get Capra Tail? No. No, Capra can drop the Demon Great Machete. But Tail, nay. You know what? Should we get the Dragon King Great Axe since we're down here? Is that going to be good for Priscilla Tail? Oh, I need that Ember. <laughs> Fuck. Well, I'll go get the Bond. No, I don't want the Bond. Ah! 
<gasps> These moves, dude, what is happening? It's worth it just for the AoE. I don't think I can AO maybe can you AoE the tail off? Like Use these. That means damage regen. Can you? Because I will RTSR AOE AOE that fluffy bass. Don't get the bonfire, but open the door just because I have the key. So. No sit, no sit, no sit. Up until Gargoyle Telax, I used fire bombs. It only took one regular fire bomb to knock a Gargoyle Tail Axe off. It's a hit, no? Yeah, I guess it, it depends on, like... Like, the way that the tails seem to work is if you strike the non-tail hitbox before the tail hitbox, then the tail does not receive damage. Right? Like, if I'm attacking and my attack happens to go through... Now, the tail... Okay, this is bad. This is really bad. Monkey shat. Dog! Alright. Reset. Let's let's Holy double butcher shit. Dog. God damn it, what am I doing here? What am I doing here? Oh, yeah! Okay, now let's go. I opened it. I just need to go grab the ember. Which is no problemo. Hey, what's up, man? So, if I do the AoE, and the first thing that the AoE touches is the Priscilla's body. Excuse me. If the first thing I touch is Priscilla's body then that will potentially negate my chance at the tail cut right so i'll really need to line myself up right but i'll give it a try chiyo 18 thank you for 13 months welcome back all is well are you going after the dlc boss tail this run all bosses. All bosses, yes. <clears throat> That's a lot of humanity. Oh, the humanity! Alright. Channeler! I forgot about the channeler. Hit it! Hit it like you mean it! Alright, come down this way then. Oi! Chandler won't be a problem once I get the tail. But for now, I gotta... You son of a duck. Alright, actually, it doesn't need to be a, a problem at all if I just run to the edge. Ow. Look at that homing. Alright, I'm gonna go through here, though. Oh, shit. My safety net! Don't you dare! Oh my god, it's two. Okay, so there's two flippies. Chandler Diagro? Chandler Diagro, I'm pretty sure. Don't yum. Oh, no, Di no Diagro. I'll be so safe over here, though. Oh, so I said I'll be safe over here, though. Oh. Bonk. I might get too close to the channeler now. Ba, 
Jump! Slam! Oh my god, the double jump. Right. I think that's more times than I have ever seen Gaping Dragon jump. Check the math, it works. What the fuck are you doing, you squishy? There you go. Just give me your damn tail so I can beat you with it already! Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah, brother. Get o get on over here. Give me your head. You better not trample all over me. Blam! I said, blam! Blam! Splanch. Now leave. I'm not gonna be able to get ahead here. It's too close to the wall. But I can do some leg hits. Hey, I want to do with you. Blonk. the head. I miss its damn dangly penis head. Uh-oh. Oh, he close. Lo oh my god, really? Yeah. Hoya! Hoya! What? Wet dongle, man. I almost R2'd right there, but chances are I would have stood up, I would have missed, and then I would have been slammed on or something. Black Town Key. Give me that homeward boner. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I had two. Catch your love was two hours after you started a Dark Souls playthrough. It only makes you wonder if you finished the game already. I did not finish the game yet. I'm going to level Dexterity. I should probably get Red Tearstone Ring, right? This is unnecessary. The initial backstab hit killed him. What's the biggest boss and smallest area, and have you done it? Um, bosses will generally only be spawned into areas that they fit. Uh, I don't know. You, I think you would have to tap the hive mind of chat to, to remember that. Because I have fought a lot of bosses in my time. In different rooms. Like, I have not fought Calamite in Capra. I'm... I'm fairly certain. Fire Sage and Capra for zero hit run for zero hit league, yeah. Um, that 
Could be. I mean, Capra is probably one of the smallest rooms, and Demon Fire Sage is a pretty chonky boss. 28 int for Moonlight Greatsword. Okay. Your character note was about a perfect medium rare steak. Nice, Pirate. <laughs> Maybe they're hallucinating from being so cold. I would like to do a magic run, probably as a second run in Elden Ring or something. I don't know what all magic is available, but I know there is magic. I don't know if they've got the, you know, the typical... Uh, hold on. I'm going to the Watchtower for what reason? Excuse me. Why am I going to the Watchtower? Oh, RTSR. Uh. Oh, so not to the Watchtower. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to uh, the bonfire down here and then backtrack. Okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. gotcha. You're going to do a dex build as it was your very first Souls build. The only thing that I remember about my very first Souls playthrough, I know there was a time I was using the Tail Axe, the Gargoyle Tail Axe. So it was certainly that. I may have used that up until I found, I know I used the Lightning Spear in Sins, which is, I think, a lot of people's experience, right? Um, and I definitely grabbed the Crystal Halberd. What I used beyond that... I don't remember. My first Souls was Demon Souls. Yes, I'm talking about my first Dark Souls playthrough. But Demon Souls I did not complete by any means. Demon Souls I didn't even get through Boletaria my first time. Uh, and that was when I dubbed From Software's video games as dumb. Dumb and not fun, man. I already used the Drake Sword. Already used it. Dumb, unfun, frickin' Zoomer crap. Uh, it's not as my perspective changing with time, but more with. I mean, I guess time put into the game. It was my friends. My friends did it. I think so, yes, Eldred. I think so. Out of bones now. Just wanted to keep that humanity. All right. We've got the ember. We've got the peculiar doll. I'm gonna upgrade. Wait a minute. All right, we were gonna upgrade the tail axe to plus 10 uh, But now I don't need to do that In going and getting the dull ember we decided to grab the tail weapon off the gaping dragon and so now we don't need that uh, <clears throat> But now Trying to make some things interesting here and go get Priscilla's tail and then use that to kill Ornstein and Smoth Ornstein and Smoth. <laughs> you rage quit Demon Souls two times in DS1 before finally beating DS1, then going into the series fully. It's tough to get in. Tough to get in. <sighs> Demon Souls is very. Demon's Souls is probably the least accessible. It has, like, all the fuck you mechanics. One death, instant, half health. I mean, if you look at it that way. I think... People who have played through Demon's Souls start to look at... Look at it more that being human is a buff to your health. Uh... 
<clears throat> as opposed to dying removing your health. Right. But that just means you have low health in, in the game in general, unless you're buffed. But yeah, item burden, um, fucking scraping spear, so much gear breaking. I mean, there's gear breaking in these games too. Long ass punishing levels, having to farm grass. Um, the fact that you're locked to B Boletaria 1 1 and you have to get through Phalanx, and if you don't know that he's weak to fire, or you've used all your fire stuff and failed, it's a big grind to get back. Uh, remake was not made easier, no. It's a big grind to get those items back, and by that time, you've probably used all of your grass, which means you need to go farm grass. No explanation on white and black tendency, um, which, funny enough, during our last playthrough of Kingsfield Ancient City, uh, it was told to me that there was actually an unused tendency mechanic in Ancient City, which is really cool. There's a, there's a white, there's like a black orb on the UI that doesn't do anything, and it was actually supposed to be for world tendency. The more you know. And, oh, I'm actually report, recording that podcast with Patrick Klepek tonight on Kingsfield Ancient City. That should be a bit of trivia, I should read it. Have you played through the JRPG Wild Arms? No. Oh, I already cut the tails here. I already cut the tails here. I cut both gargoyle tails. I mean, they regrow their tails. I'm not going to make myself cut them again. But I already, ha I already got the weapon from the first one. We learned that the second one doesn't actually drop a weapon. Um, you know what? I want a little bit more dexterity before getting Priscilla's dagger. So let's kill Gwendolyn. Ready? Like I said, only one dropped. Yes, we equipped it. That's why we backtracked to level it up, and then we got the Dragon King Great Axe instead. My retro gaming podcast is called the Saturday Morning Gaming Show! Exclamation point podcast. I will have to get details on Patrick Klepek slash way, waypoints. Shut your ass! Shut up! Uh, waypoint podcast. What um, foolishness! Yeah, 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 foolishness. Foolishness. More souls knowledge. You can skip getting the the Dark Moon Seance Ring and or killing Gwendolyn. Uh, Gwen, uh, Guinevere, pardon me. By just jumping up against the, the uh, wall there. Save and quitting mid roll. And vla -dee da dee da One. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, it's gonna take a few times, isn't it? Yep. Blah. Ugh. Okay. I think we saw Gwendolyn once in Zero Hit League so far. Is that right? I'm waiting for the... There we go. That's what I'm waiting for. Yeah. Does it still make it dark this way? That's a good question. We'll find out, though. Yeah? Yeah. One more time. You want to see another Dark Souls whip run? I've actually done that quite a few times compared to something like this or other other runs. We did our, our Reese. I think we've done whip only, like... I don't know, three or four times. You going? No, you're doing this. Yep. Goodbye. A little bit more dexterity. Yeah. 
the most extreme run I've ever done. I mean, that depends on what you think is extreme. So you can type in exclamation point challenge runs and see for yourself what you think. Yeah, it did not go dark. It did not go dark. What you think is the most extreme run. We've done a lot of crazy runs though. We've done fist only, we've done Bloodborne Fist Only New Game Plus 7 DLC. We've done uh, we've been Fist Only in all the games, I think. We did New Game Plus 7 Fist Only Dark Souls 3. We've done No Heal No Bonfire. That's one of my favorite runs of all time. Um, uh, Soul Level 1 New Game Plus 7 Fresh Start is a really cool run. Um... That's where you just hack your game into New Game Plus 7, but you start as Soul Level 1 and you don't level. That one is really rough for Four Kings. That's the hardest part of the run for sure. Um, the Clear Lordran run, where you kill all the enemies in the game without touching a bonfire after the world is... after the bosses are all cleared. Because... Well, I don't know why, because... Oh, because you need to just progress through the game. But we can do that again with bosses and give ourselves all of the equipment that, like but that kind of hacks it i don't know i see oops all gwens except the models are shrunk to half size Ugh. Ugh. that would be really rough on reading what's going on pyro flame r2 only light knight bearded wisdom nice option to play for non-soul gods use a randomizer set all enemies as bosses and all bosses as normal enemies and it's said that they do not respawn. You have a ton of souls to level up in a really fun time. Also with item randomization. Interesting. Dun -dun. Have you ever done all bosses run? No. How about enemies shrinked? Every enemy shrunk. Shrunken enemies. <laughs> Uh, we kind of did that when we did the Giant Souls. That was in Dark Souls 3. We did Giant Souls. We also did Tiny Souls. Uh, which is a really interesting r run as well. Okay, so, let's, let's focus here. We're finally here. We're at... The Painted World. We have Dragon King Great Axe. I want the Blood Shield... Ow, holy damaging shit. Just in case we need to fight Priscilla, I'm gonna get the blood shield uh, for the bleed resist. Oh, you know what? We don't have the bleed resist from the gargoyle tail axe anymore. You know, I don't really... <sighs> okay, whatever. Super Andered, 77 months. I'm not gonna be able to fast roll if I use the um, armor. So that's going to be interesting. Jesus. Bro, are you serious? I almost got killed by Hollow. Centaur CS. 14 months. Welcome back. Are you worried you'll kill her before the tail? I'm not worried about that. I'm worried about... having to just deal with her after she is... invisible. I mean... Oh, well, not even invisible. It's just she's got a hard tail to hit. Right, uh, let's see here. What do we do here? We bait the breath, and then we attack here, I think. Wait for a swipe. Oh. Then breath again, right? Yep, yeah. breath. Oh my god. Ah! What? Okay. Something new every day, huh? <laughs> I didn't walk off. I got slammed by the boss. Oh. Alright, I didn't want the humanity anyways. Ahem. Was your overall opinion on Zero Hit League? Would you change anything? Uh, would I change anything? Probably, but... 
It's great. It's fucking awesome. It's one of the most... One of the things I've been most excited for with Souls in a long time. And, uh... It, it gets that adrenaline pumping like... I had not experienced probably since Sekiro first playthrough. It's one of those first playthrough things. Or I guess maybe challenge runs. Maybe like when I did Ishin, no upgrades, no heal. That was probably the last time I felt that sort of adrenaline rush. But I don't even think it was that bad. Oh, welcome back, you stupid fat fart. All right, get out of here, you dang hollow man. I don't know. I, I, got, I got clipped inside of the undead dragon there, so that was weird. But it happened. Oh, okay. All right. There's a toxic man. Oh, wow. The friendly fire. Uh, sir, I don't, uh... Oh, God. Oh, God. He, um... Mm. Look, I don't... Please, thank you. Okay. That's what I want. I wanted the backstab. Invisible goop. Oh, wait. It's not invisible? Entirely? Oh, it's not invisible? What? Yes, it is. I'm just going to run up the middle and have him do the middle breath. That's safer, I think. Oh, what the? Oh, that was a good one. Oh, he's doing this. Visible goop. Do middle goop. Middle goop. Thank you. Wait, that's... This is where it went wrong! This is where things went wrong! This is where things went incorrectly and I got the dong in the face. Let's go. You doing that side? Alright, I'm going this side then. And plunge. Hello? Am I... I'm hitting him. Okay, that's good. It is good that I'm hitting him. This is not what I'm... I guess I normally have more damage when I do this sort of thing. Whoa! Ha! <laughs> Okay. Oh, that's the attack I'm used to him doing. Oh, shit. Is that true? I'm not used to this boss at all. Okay. Let's just say we're not used to it. Uh-oh. Okay. Yeah. Oh, God. But prompted a tail weapon only run. It's a very cool run that I don't have a YouTube video of because we did it long before the YouTube archives were such a consistent thing. Here's another thing. This run is just full of stuff that you may not know. Here's a dragon butt. It is, in, it is invulnerable. Well, you can make it stand up so you can get past it. And here we are. So now we're uh, at Priscilla. Now that you've done so well in Zero Hit League, maybe you can do a Zero Hit run of DS1 in a Saint, as a St. Jude reward. Uh, I mean, I could, yeah. Hello? Wait a minute, but the knight's going to drop down. Is the knight going to drop down? What is he even drop? Oh, he drops down from that side yet. Come here. Come here. There we go. Ah, shit. Kill. No, not kill. I kill you, kill me first before I kill you. Well, at least the undead dragon's dead. As not an enemy, I fight very much. Uh, this way, this way, this way. Yep, Season 2 of Zero Hit League will be Dark Souls 3. It will begin exactly two months after Elden Ring launch. So it's going to be a big wait. But uh, obviously everybody is going to be playing Elden Ring, so... Deal with it! 
Gate closed. Just a small amount of kill. Okay. What? What's that sound? Is that like a... A scripted sound for the... The undead dragon that... Wait a minute. This is all I wanted. Was... Urtzer! I've got my Urtzer! Do not shoot me in the back with the bow and arrow! Do not shoot me in the back with an arrow! Do not shoot me in the back with an arrow! Okay, we're gonna try this. This is gonna be... Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, so put ourselves exactly, like, as far away... There. That's kind of what I want there. We're going for the tail. I'm gonna try an R2 just to get the tail off. If we get the tail... I'm happy we can we can just fuck Priscilla up normally. <sighs> is this a this is a raise slam or is it actually a slam? I don't remember. Do I walk forward? Um still fast roll without havels? Uh I don't know. Doesn't matter. Raise slam, right? Raise and slam. I've got several attempts at least. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. A little bit closer. I need to hit that tail, not her, right? Like, it needs to count as a tail hit. Oh, Fuck yeah, brother. Fuck yeah, brother. Where's she at? Oh my god. Smash. Breathe your stupid jizz snow at me. How about that? Hello? Hello? Let's just finish this. How about it? Do the jizz. Oh, shit. Is she going to follow up? No, she didn't. Uh, there she goes. I have no idea, actually, where that attack goes, but... Ah! Ma! Die. Oh, wait, I guess I needed to equip tail, huh? Well. Have we done that? It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. My rules. My rules are the high rules, all right? So, we're not going to reset. Are there any other Souls player streamers you'd like to see join the league next season? I'll be honest, I didn't know any of them besides Hob going into it. So, I would like to meet more people who dedicate all so much time to the Souls series just like I do. It's fun to meet those people. Lobo's considered doing a moan percent world record attempt. You mean speed run to, to moan percent? No. <laughs> Even meeting people. Well, by meeting people, so it was you. I guess I, uh, that if we, if we call what we've done with Zero Hit League meeting people, it's just playing Dark Souls with them, basically. Fat rolls ASAP. Okay, uh, let's see here. Now it's time to make it to the blacksmith giant. Um, <clears throat> blacksmith giant to upgrade this. It's it's gonna be dragon scales, isn't it? That's not bad. It's not bad at all. Oh shit, oh shit. She does fat roll, yep. A Jedi. Ooh. Go, are you gonna go buff? Oh no! You're gonna, ah! Uh! No! Panic roll. Fucking Richard's cousin over here. Niece. Get over here! 
You're out of cast? Wait, was that with the parrying dagger? Suck a bag of Oreo dicks. Thank you. But how? This woman is a threat. Who are you talking to? Oh, he's already dead, though. She's already dead. That would have been an OP starting class. What? Her? Her gear? Are we going to get the Dark Souls RPG book? Essentially a Dark Souls D&D 5 ebook. Oh, yeah. I was asked if I wanted to participate in a, um, a, like, a demo campaign of that. We'll see if that happens. Uh, but there's been a lot of things happening in the last... Wait, what is this? Best forklift operator demo available now. Forklift operator simulator is what we got. I was just checking my email. That's okay. Hmm. That's it. Are you shutting my duck? Donkle bonk. All right. Back here. Shinmu. Wait a minute. I can use a freaking shield. I can use armor. What am I thinking? Especially if I take off the RTSR. We can do a full freaking nice armor set. This will be beautiful. Wait. Well, I can do this. Hell yeah, brother. Oh, you know what? We could test the weird back attacks here. But I don't think there's a weird back attack with the... I mean, I think they have just the... Well, anyways... You thought it was a tail run. This is Priscilla's dagger, a tail weapon. Um, not using the shiny nice new shield. Yeah, why would I use that? It was for Priscilla, but uh, I was focused on the fight when we got there, so. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! Who's going to be the hardest boss to beat in this run? Artorius with the Guardian Tail, Sanctuary Guardian Tail Whip. That's going to be the hardest fight. Excuse me. British Wolf! One moment. Oh yeah, it's got a... These fucking painting guardians, dude. They are the trolliest SOBs. British Wolf, 65 months, welcome back. What they do is they give the painting guardian an instant gap close backstab so that you're ready for PvP when you start PvPing. Um, oh. That way, when it happens in PvP, you're like, oh, that's just something that happens in Dark Souls. That's not. Poor network code by any means. No latency abuse. No. No. That's just Dark Souls. Yeah, we are going to use the Moonlight Great Sorry, We're going to need a lot of int, though, before that. Four Kings will not be easy with a dagger if he goes for that. Hmm? We're definitely going to be changing weapons before Four Kings. Uh, what will be the next... weapon that we go for? Um... Let's see, after this, things open up. And, whoop, uh... Uh... Centipede Demon Arm, but that's not... There's no weapon there. Smo's Tail. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we already got the Dragon Greatsword. Mm-hmm. Exultation might kill V. Thank you both for resubscribing. Please tell Leo he's the best boy. Uh oh, come on. Right. It's Mo's front tail. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. 
Just have Guardian, Seath, and Calamite left. Is that true? Okay, so I will almost very certainly go for the DLC ASAP after this. Is what we'll do. Guardian Tail, Obsidian, and Moonlight. We used all of our weapons way too quickly. So I will definitely go to the DLC. We're going to do the painful uh, yet satisfying Guardian Tail Whip. Artorius. We'll get the Obsidian Greatsword from... Calamite, and then that will carry us while we build intelligence in order to wield the Moonlight Jurette Sward. Why am I doing this? Uh, that's a good question I asked myself. Um, am I going to get Havel's I don't know why I'm doing this. Uh, yeah, Smo bleeds. Does Ornstein bleed? I'm going to do Ornstein second because I don't usually do that. Even though I'm pretty confident in my phase two Ornstein skills. Getting from the tail from Calamy is very easy and I will show it to you. Easier than Priscilla in, in my opinion. Well, unless you have a guaranteed setup like we did for that, which wasn't guaranteed, but I'm, I'm glad it worked. Um, I will show you the ways of the Calamy tail. The, the nice thing about Calamite Tail is you can always do the tail strats. Uh, there is no reset. Like, for example, if you miss Seath's and your normal strategy is to use the crystal to stun him, which it is for me, but you mess up and you don't get the tail, that's it. You got to go with backup strats, which suck. Well, they suck because I haven't done them. Uh, it might not be as bad as I think. Um, Calmeth, sure. Missing some dragon scales. Well, rip. Excited to get Ornstein and Big Ornstein in this run? What we use to cut seats, though? Obsidian Dragon Sword from Calamy. The slow run is on, on pause because all of the Dark Souls online servers are down while they fix the RCE exploit. Uh, and that is going to be the case until after Elden Ring, which means it's going to be a while before we get back to the slow run. Oh yeah, that goes over the shield. I forgot. Cause I got a lot, a lot of Elden Ring for me to play. Well, this is good. this is gonna be. A... Let's see. Three Estus, Priscilla's dagger, O and S. This might be a tough one as well. But luckily, luckily, I think the bleed will will work. What exploit? The... Well, it's not gonna be a thing anymore. But there was ways to, you know, hack and remote control people's computers, basically. All right. What the fuck? That was bunk, you bastard slut meat. Um, I bleed. And there was a bleed proc. Not too bad, eh? Thumb, thumb, thumb. Thumb, 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 Rep and bum, 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 bum. No mm. oh, shit. Da, 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 da. Okay. Yeah, follow up there, you dunkus. If I can get some hits here. Bum, bum, bleed. Yes. Bum, bum, bleed. Bleed this. Weed. Yeah. Oh, God. 
All right. Big O. Cut off some of those balls. Look at that nip. Tasteful smoboob. In all 3DS games, what is your favorite boss encounter? Become engorged. Engorgedstein. Ah, fuck! Pretty confident in my Ornstein. Big Ornstein, by the way. All right, let's see. Now I'm confident. What the fuck is he doing? <laughs> Do you bleed, sir? Do you bleed? I do believe that you bleed. That would be nice if you bled. Could you bleed? That's gonna be a lot of blood if he bleeds. Ah, he bleed! Cool. Coo, mate. Coo. Whoop. Do you believe your blood on the floor? Oh, shit. Get out of here. Hey. Love us, no, not share. No, I don't share what you think about share. God damn it. Bum, 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 bum. Oh god, that was a jump! Wow, I almost got hit by the butt slam. Hey. Oh, that's gonna be a hit! Oh, what? What? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? Bleed! Bleed on me! Yeah. Nice. It's a lot of blood. Near Rock, thanks for the 45 months, by the way. If I miss you, welcome back. So much music reference. It just works. There's just a lot of opportunity. What is the dex A scale? Okay. Okay, I need to start thinking ahead of time uh, ahead of time for Guardian Tail Whip scaling. <laughs> uh no, nah, non-existent, dude. I don't. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah, I do need to level into your right. Yeah, we need to go full intelligence. Well, actually, no, it's not. We're going to be really close. Especially after all of the freaking. After all the DLC boss souls. Oh. It is pretty expensive to do that, though, no. Is it only 20 ish int for MLGS? The thing is, you can also get by if you don't have the stats. It's just... I don't think... Do you bounce, actually? Come hither, child. Uh, look, I used firebombs early in the match, so... Uh, fuck you. <laughs> Calamite Tail with Guardian Tail. Yes. That is what's happening. Okay. I'm going to Lord Vessel Place. I even hit her in the tail. Why, though? Faster. <clears throat> what is it? Is it 20? Oh. You sorry fool. Huh? 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 Now, let's go get... I have to kill the Hydra with Priscilla's dagger. Oh my God. Okay, let me pee.
Mm. Yes. Yes. You missed my sound effects on this part. Bang, 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 bang. Ordering food. Food has been. Wait. I'm gonna get a healthy juice. Strawberry cuckoo cooler. I'm gonna get. Ooh, nice. <clears throat> Fresh squeezed juice. Get equipped with food. Hello, Steve. Hello, everyone. MLGS is 28 int. Armored Caster says 27 int. Could we get a ban on Armored Caster? Thank you very much for spreading misinformation. We are going to... Oh, boy. Hold on. Let me think. Um... I can get one more upgrade, which would make the Hydra a little more um, tolerable if I... I should have grabbed that other... I should have done a lot of things. I should have killed Hydra when we were running through the basin to go get RTSR without... I think we had a good weapon there, but... Clink. Whether you forge penises or armor first. Well, that's up to you. Uh, Hydra. It, um, you know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go kill Sif right now. Sorry, but I am going to go kill Sif because Sif bleeds. Sif bleeds. Ooh, 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 ooh. One moment, I got a response from the Bamco. Let me get to a safe spot. <clears throat> Give me a safe spot. Large soul of an English soldier. Ah, oh, shit, I gotta go... I gotta go buy it. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna be able to say anything to you guys. <clears throat> but... just have to see. <laughs> Better safe than assassinated by cyborg ninjas. That is a good point. Uh, cyborg ninjas are really difficult to handle in real life. They just damned me, yeah, the entire plot of Elden Ring, so... <clears throat> kind of a shame, but... Do I have any... Uh, Sixty-nine or oh, two thousand? Oh. 
BRB. Feast of Sin. Two months. Welcome back. Um... Let me one sec. Ah. <clears throat> uh. Here's what I can say. Um, I will be playing Elden Ring on Thursday. You can bet your butt on that. You can bet your butt. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's also when the game comes out. <clears throat> so, <laughs> it's not on... Not unexpected. Do boss weapons count? No. I mean, boss tails, yeah. We've gotten all of the tails except for... Three? What do I bet against your butt? Your penis. If you don't have a penis, I'm sorry. I made an assumption, and that's that's wrong. Uh, it's just a fact that like ninety-seven percent of my audience is male, so <laughs> according to the YouTube analytics, anyways. Uh, Final boss unringable patches. What do we have to cut your butt off and use it against the next streamer? What? So you can't play on stream to? No, no. That's not what I'm saying at all, Secret Squid. I don't know where you got that from. I'm just telling you that I am playing Elden Ring on Thursday. Ooh, an ember. I need this. Delta B. See you after Elden Ring. Fair. Enjoy it. See you on the other side. Mythic six months gamer. That's my name. Don't wear it out. You say in front of my computer all day Thursday. <clears throat> Play on Thursday too, but not until like 9 p.m. Less than three days. Uh, are we at the two? No, it's. Uh, so at this point, it is. Uh, what's today? Monday. One, two, three. Three days, two hours, and 13 minutes until Elden Ring Steam release. What am I streaming on Wednesday? We're doing the Dark Souls Zero Hit League on Wednesday. Oi! Get these stupid trees! I tell you what, we'll we'll keep these keep things interesting here, and let's go do Moonlight Butterfly. Why does the counter say three days, ten hours? Because that is a website that somebody created who guessed at when the release time is, and it's pretty darn accurate. At least for the hundred days that we've had it, it's been extremely close to the release time. The exact timing of it is something that we learned literally today. And uh, console release and Steam release are different and different around the world. So there's not really any one time that is a correct answer, except for your time. They guessed like 200 days ago. Yeah, we've had, we, we started this in the 140-ish range. 
Can I use consumables? Yes, because I used it. That's the only way I could get past Asylum Demon. Um, without using a weapon. Consumables are always legit on these sorts of runs. I guess I could use some consumables on Moonlight Butterfly here just to get us a little bit of damage advantage. Damage advantage around, you know? Yeah. My Budak Firebomb. Oh, I'm out. All right, that's it. Hello. I don't think Moonlight Butterfly would bleed. It's sort of a magic being, yeah? I'm just gonna stand here and take it. I don't even give a shit. That's fine. Activate Moonlight Butterfly's second phase attack. Fly over and nuke. I forgot I can use it. Oh, there it is. The flyover nuke. <laughs> it's not about outrunning the nuke. In fact, if you try to, you're going to have a bad time. I usually bait it and then I 180 and go the opposite direction. This is really weird. I have not fought Moonlight Butterfly a lot on Remastered, and the VFX are all different. I mean, I've done it, but, like, I have way more time spent fighting original Moonlight Butterfly. Double the beam! Oh. Like, those look totally different. Here we go. Oh, he's even got the little cubby here. And if you've ever wondered why Moonlight Butterfly comes down, it's munching on the moss and it actually heals. I have done consumables only. It is awful. Highly do not recommend. Um, no shit. Yeah. You can rewind the VOD and see that it's healing when it's chilling there. Isn't that sad? He's just trying to eat. I, don't I mean, I don't know about the eating moss. That's what people have said. And, but the healing is absolutely there. Oops. There isn't necessarily a moss eating animation, but it does heal. It could just be resting. You know why you have to fight it at all? Well, to get the uh, watchtower basement key if you don't have another way in. It could be tired from flying, but I like the other explanation better, personally. Thou fared well to fly. Yeah, shut up. Whoop. You mean plot-wise? Oh, yeah, that goes for, like, every single boss in this game. Like, why do you need to kill it? Why do you need to do any of this? <clears throat> cat abuse. Nah, I didn't abuse that cat. Oh, the last run for Dark Souls B before Elden Rings and Zero Hit League B. This one. This is the last full stream before Elden Ring re releases, and I stream it. Because I am off tomorrow. Tuesdays are my weekend. Uh, Wednesday is normally an off day, but we have Zero Hit League. So we'll have two hours of not Zero Hit League. Then we'll have Zero Hit League. And on Wednesdays, I end right after my match, and then I raid over to Happy Hob. Um... And then, the next time I go live... Will be... Elden Ring. Two hours of not Zero Hit League. Yes. Are you not going to watch the outcome of Zero Hit League live? I will watch it, but I will not stream it. You guys can go watch it. 
Am I okay? I will be. I will be. <laughs> After I kill this dog. Murdering the... Oh, God. All the species of the world. That's some poop damage, huh? That's okay. We got bleed. I got the blood. I got the blood on the side. Bleed me. Bleed him up. Bleed him up good. I said bleed him up good. Not bad. Bleed him up good. Bleed him up gooder than how much you're bleeding him up now. Would you... Oh my god. Bleed! I wonder if the two-handed attack is better. I'm gonna try two-handing. There's a bleed proc. Of course, that includes all the buildup from before. Right, I don't have to worry about getting staggered. This isn't zero. <laughs> like, this is bleed every... Bleed the world. Holy fucking the voice. That's awesome. Bleed, you buttery dog! I'm going back to one hand. Get more hits in, I feel like. There's a bleed. Oh, oh it's gonna limp so hard. Tony Pizide, welcome back. Flaps. Welcome back. Oh no, oh no. Are we Sagimus? Wow. Block and roll. That was like frame perfect to, to get that to happen. Oh no. Sad sip. Bleed already and die. There you go. Wait, stop. Are you practicing your dog sushi making? <clears throat> yes. Is that a reference to uh, Link Sushi from uh, Zero Hit League yesterday? I did. I took the dog's bone. Well, it's the opposite of giving a dog a bone. You know? Taking the dog a bone. You're taking a dog. Fucking English is dumb. <clears throat> oh. If you give a dog a bone. They're getting a bone, right? But if you take a dog a bone, you're taking a dog bone from somewhere and giving it to the dog still. Give and take are opposites, except in that case, no. How do you explain that to somebody? Like, yeah, just remember that. It's dumb. It's like takeaway. You're taking the bone. Take a dog a bone. Of course, context matters, but free Lex. 19 months, welcome back. English was a mistake. Yeah. Thanks, Freelex. Now it's time for a Hydra. Yay! Does Hydra bleed? I don't think we'll ever proc bleed on Hydra. We'll see. English is not your native language. Care to explain? I mean, that's the thing is it's... There's not really anything to explain, like... If the dog is way over there... If the dog is way over there, you can take something to the dog, right? You get something and you take it to him. But if you give a dog a bone, you're like, there you go, I'm giving you this bone. But to give something... I guess the difference is take away. You take something away. That's what I was getting at. Yeah, take two and take from. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to focus on s slicing this stupid Hydra neck. No. Uh, oh, wait, yeah, 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 shit. So I guess there's some contact missing. See? Oh.
Okay, not too bad. I can't even see, but I know where I need to be and hit. So at least there's that. There we go. Did I get the... Yeah, I did. Ah, shit. Did you just say take one, do? Which is a martial art. <clears throat> yeah, you can also take a dump, which is expelling fecal matter from your body. So that's another use of take where you're not acquiring something. It's the opposite. Stop this. And then you can take a walk, which doesn't, has nothing to do with the acquisition or the, it's dumb. I mean, every language has weird shit like that, to be fair. Okay, I don't know every language. I cannot make that statement. This is gonna be great, the last head. So no more head. Oh, nice, got it. All right, you ready? You start here, you roll left. One leap attack. Yeah! Okay, I don't know if that's gonna work with this weapon. Okay, I can t I hit the snoot. I can boop the snoot, but I need to reset him, so I'm gonna go this way. This is annoying, but the Hydra will attack based on where he's facing. And he'll face me to do the attack. Oh, wait. He didn't really face me, though. So I need him to turn. I need him to turn. 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 That. Oh, he's spitting. He's spitting. That's okay. That'll give me time to get over. Oh, he didn't spit. He did not spit. I lied. Snoot boop. I don't have any more fire bombs. Oh, my ledge. That's a ledge to my death. Spitting. Spitting absolutely nowhere near me. A valid strategy. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. But now you can actually hit me right here. Don't fall. Yes! <clears throat> okay. The golem fight is also going to be awful, but anyways. At least I don't have to wait for it to fucking do these attacks. Another little bit of trivia. In unpatched Dark Souls, you can cut all of the Hydra's heads, and it will have no attacks. They patched it later so that it dies if it loses all, loses all its heads. You could obviously kill it with ranged, like a bow or something. But, uh... Yeah. Ah, melee only, you're fucked. It will still be alive, yes. They patched it that it dies when it loses all of its heads. You would just have to reset the fight. Which means you would have to deal enough damage. The only way that can happen is like with this build where you're doing such low damage that the overkill on the Hydra's head health doesn't spill enough to remove, you know, all of the health bar. So you'll only see it with low damage. They did a lot of things. They buffed soul counts. I really want to and need to do another unpatched Souls run. I haven't done it since I played on Xbox 360 forever ago. Um, but we could get like a PS, PS3 copy or something. 
Oh wait, PS3 is kind of awful. There was never an unpatched PC version because the when it was ported to PC, it came with the DLC and everything was obviously updated by them. Nikolai like, dropped like 5k. Uh, okay. But yeah, I would be really interested to see all the changes because I don't remember them, that's for sure. Okay. We've rescued Dusk. Now it's time to go to the Duke's archives. And we can re... We can uh, upgrade this weapon one more time. The curse effect stacked. Yes, you could get double cursed. I don't know how far it stacks. Probably just twice, but I'm not I'm not certain. Fun fact, if you kill kill that gold golem with the chaos fireball that leaves lava, it will insta-kill the princess when she spawns. Yeah, that's a lesson to be careful with your pyromancy. It went to one eighth HP? My goodness. Um uh, reinforce. Hell yeah. Microby, five months. Hey ho. Hey. Hey ho hey. Someone could probably mod the changes into remastered. Probably can't mod in the bugs too. Yeah, I mean it would just be easier to get. I still have my Xbox 360, although I probably need a new power supply for it. Intelligence! Okay. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I thought about it for a moment and I remembered. Oh, yeah, that's right. We ordered food. Is it here yet? And here you are with four Xbox 360s near you. I used to work at a... Uh, at a cyber cafe. Well, I worked at two cyber cafes, actually. But the latter that I worked at was also a console repair shop and that was back in the Xbox 360 PS3 days Red Ring of Death all that so my lordy I saw my fair share of Red Rings and all that the all the error diagnostics E74 I don't remember them <clears throat> my one horror story was somebody had a PlayStation 3 that stopped working and when they opened it up it was just full of like bugs and eggs and shit and oh my god <laughs> so, so bad. it was not it was terrible they love that heat they love that heat you know here's what i'm gonna do i want this bonfire you only need to kill the second boar to use the bonfire. That is horrifying. Yeah. They're like, I don't know why my PS3 is not working. Oh, it's because it's full of, you know, insect sheddings and dead bodies. God damn. Bruh. Slowly but surely. Uh oh. It's okay. I wonder if it bleeds. It is a boar, right? There is a boar inside there. But it, admittedly, I don't know how how well we are penetrating its armor. <clears throat> Penetration. Will it bleed? Popular subseries to Will It Blend. I don't think it's gonna bleed. Don't think it's gonna bleed. Uh, at this point, it's gonna be hard to tell if it does. No, it didn't bleed. Did not bleed. 
Perhaps on the last hit. Let's see. If blood flies everywhere... No. What does this run? This is a tail weapon only run. So we started the game. We used fire bombs to kill the asylum demon. And we rushed to gargoyles. Got the gargoyle tail axe with fire bombs. And since then, we've been using only tail weapons and all tail weapons. And anytime I encounter a new tail weapon, we... Uh, we swap it out and get rid of the the previous weapon. It's like a use what you see run, except with terrible hit, terrible crystal soldier hitboxes. I'm just kidding. <clears throat> oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Who is this run? Just backstabbing the boys. Having the time penetrating all the boys. <clears throat> I'm penetrating the boys. Ooh, ooh. Penetrating. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Come here. <clears throat> this thing is upgraded plus three. It really does not shine against very physical defensive enemies like all of these. <laughs> like everything that we're fighting here. Boars, crystal mans, golems. It has very good bleed though. Don't you dare do it, shoulder. Oh, he did. Oh my shouldery shit, dude. With a buff, a buffed shoulder strike is nasty ass. Nostalgia hit with that song? Yeah, I know. Penetrating Boys was just such an old pastime, you know, back in the day. Oh, really? Thank God for backstab iframes. It's A scaling decks right now. Might be better at plus five, but. I will now sing the song whenever people come into my chat and ask, why do you have the bisexual tag for your stream? Nice. I like that. Do you think Elden Ring will have a good mod community? Yes. Diamond, 815, 26 months. Welcome back. Lobo's doing what he does best. Getting some tail. Doing my best. Penetrating boys, getting tail. You know. Woo! This thing's got to be on the... Like, the durability... Oops. I wonder... Oh, 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 the stagger with the dagger. The old dagger, stagger, swagger. Didn't think it could be done. All right. Now, we're not doing Seath yet. Seath is going to be the last tail that we cut. Instead, we're going to the DLC. And we're going to cut the possibly the worst weapon in the game. And we're going to make as good a use of it as we can. It's terrible, baby Caleb. Okay, it's not as bad as straight sword hilt. It's not that bad. Okay. <clears throat> also, we're going to have just such a tiny reach to get that... To get that uh, tail. Oh, I didn't get rid of my other tail weapons. Pardon me. I don't need to, but just for inventory space anyways. Blood shield. Alright, bye. How does the whip scale? Horribly. Did you do Drake Sword? Yes. We have done all of the tail weapons except for Guardian Tail, Whip. Calamite Tail, and the uh, Moonlight Sword. Wait. Yeah. 
The Moonlight Greatsword will be our ultimate <clears throat> and final weapon. Because I think that's interesting. Framp pays a hefty sum for most tail weapons? Wow. Well, I placed the Lord Vessel without talking to Framp, aside from him going, huh? When I landed on him and plunging attacked. Uh, so that... It's fine, though. It's fine. Whips kind of got the shaft. Yeah, they're pretty bad. They cannot be parried, though. So that is a unique benefit to a whip, right? You could use it as something to throw off people in PvP, right? If it... If, uh... If it were stronger... And couldn't be parried, that could be pretty OP, right? You can offhand parry with the whip. Nice. Yeah, so you have like a solid weapon in the main hand. Whip offhand. You can parry. You can hit through shield. Which boss as would you like to see return in Elden Ring? No. You should PvP with whip after the run. PvP with whip after the run. <clears throat> Ah, uh, <laughs> that sounds awful. <laughs> Which sounds like Lobo's content, to be honest, but I will probably pass on that idea. Don't be honest. I hope that's fine. Uh, are there any weapons you'd like to see return in Elden Ring? No. No. It is not that I don't want to see them return. It's that I literally don't care. I know nothing, I don't want to know anything, and whatever Miyazaki does, I am grateful for, and I will experience, and, uh, yeah. No expectations, no desires. I'm just sitting at a table with a mystery dish coming out that I know is going to be fantastic, and I can't wait to taste every bit of it. Every tiny, teeny, dick bit. Let's get a tail. Maybe I should RTSR for this. I'm gonna try and get hit by the last of his melee combo and see if that puts me in RTSR. Anything else will probably kill me. Here we go. There we go. Oh. The last hit, though. Not the... <clears throat> not the third hit. I went I went for the third because I realized that the third okay. First attack is head. The next two are paw attacks and I believe the paw attacks do less damage. And I was worried that the fourth being a head strike, which may not actually be a head strike, would have done too much damage. But either way I died. There's our setup, baby! <laughs> Much better. Alright. Come here. Uh, that's not, um... Yeah, no. I'd like a swoop. Swoop would be great. Uh, I think swoop is really the best for this. I don't know that he's going to lower the tail here at all. That's pretty much it. Swoop. Dun, 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 dun. There it is. Hey, that's actually not bad damage. What the fuck? Yeah. Okay. That's all thanks to the red tear stone ring. Stop doing that! Oh, there you go. Yeah! Okay, I'll be back. Bye. Um. Oh, I don't have a. Actually, I'll just save him quick. BRB reading essays. Okay. So, yeah, if you do... If you roll into him for the... 
that attack, it seems like I can get to the tail. Now, I'll be back. Time for pain. I didn't do this with the other other boss fights, but I'm going to go ahead and do this. Ew, it even is heavy enough that... Oh, it's fine. Yeah, I'm not. I'm absolutely not red tears and ringing this. You know what? Here, we're going to... Before we do this, I'm going to go kill Pinwheel. I'm going to go kill Pinwheel so we can max our Estus. Just in case. You never know. Just being safe as possible. Also, we can see what kind of damage this thing does to Pinwheel. It is C-scaling with Dex. Let's see. It should be normal upgrade. Let me double check. Yes. I need eight Titanite shards. So it was worth it that we picked up the um, large ember. Oops. Modify. Reinforce. We'll need to go to the... Oh, we're going to need to get the very large ember as well. Um, I wasn't counting. What is this? Plus four? Plus eight? I mean, <laughs> okay, so two more levels. So is that two, three? So five large Titanite shards. Chamber of the Princess. I'll be streaming Elden Ring Thursday, Telegamer. Oh, I have one that's unused. Yeah, 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 you're right. Rai 2K, 49 months. Welcome back. Just rooting for Pinwheel on this one because he deserves a W. Shadows Rain. Hello, Bose. I am getting into challenge runs myself and starting in Dark Souls 1. Are there any beginner friendly runs you'd recommend? Soul level 1. Shield. No shield if you rely on shield. Um. Magic, if you rely on melee. Melee, if you rely on magic. No healing. Oopsies. Uh, really, you take away the things that you rely on. That's how you get better. You tackle the game in a way that's hard for you. And then you learn to succeed. Bow only, sure. Um... The, the nice thing is you get to choose what run and how difficult it is for you. You can change it on the fly. There is no... A lot of people come to me and they, they ask me like, I'm doing this run, but I did this. Does it still count? And that's just not... That's not a thing. There's an, it always counts. You do the run however you enjoy doing the run. There we go. Oh, whoops. Oh, I need one more. Call me soon. And if anybody tells you otherwise, you kick them in the shin, okay? You kick them in the shin until they hold their leg and cry. Because that's dumb. Alright? What's your most favorite unusual runs in Dark Souls that you ever did? Uh, my favorite one that whenever people ask that, no heal, no bonfire was probably one of my favorite ones. That or bow aim only mode. So you play the entire game while aiming with the bow in the zoom mode. It's it's bad. It's terrible. But we did it. Um, it certainly could be worse, though. We already have at least one chunk. Why would you do that? Dude. You know how many times I've played this game? You know how many times of runs? Ah! I can't even parry with this stupid whip. All right, dude, you're gonna get the ultimate disrespect, and that is death by guardian tail whip. All right, it's happening. I can parry and hit him. Can't parry and repulse. Come here, dude. Get your shit. Can't backstab or anything. I'm gonna build up toxic on this dude. Get, look at this damage. You like that? That's plus 10. That's plus 10 damage. I mean, uh, yeah. Um, wait, does it toxic or is it poison? I think it just poisons. The boss toxics. No, maybe it is toxic. 
What is this idiot? Come here. Attack. Attack, you fart. I suck. Oh, my sucking suck. Make him attack the blacksmith. <clears throat> I'm not doing that. Uh, Pedro Pirocas 07. Thank you for that prime sub. Welcome to the wolf pack. Is the other guy here waiting for me? To, to kill steel? No? Counter damage, by the way. 47, pretty good. Actually, it seems like he blocked that, kind of. I'll try an R2. Ready? Two-handed R2. There you go, that's better. Plus 10. And we're going to the DLC. <laughs> uh, oh my god. I committed to doing this now in addition to Artorias. Jesus suck. All right. Okay. Uh, and we're going to go kill Pinwheel. This is, uh, I'm not warping. I don't have any Homeward Bones. No, it's Mornstein or Dead. We're going to fight the DLC with this, which is far worse than Ornstein and Smo with this. Just so you know. So uh, get your favorite snack and bevy. My food is here, so, uh, yeah, I'll be finding points to eat during the fight, probably, and it's, uh, YouTube fast forward about, um, oh, I don't know, two hours, that's probably when we'll get Calamite's tail, and things will become reasonable again, because I still need to go get this to plus 15, so, yeah. We have all the tail weapons, except for... Calamite's tail and Seath's tail. Um, I will not try to get Seath's tail with this weapon. No, no, no. No, no, no. I will be right back grabbing my food. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Nice. Thank you all for showing up today. Hope you're having a happy Monday, and I hope that this run is helping move the time along until Elden Ring. Oh, Elden Ring is bestowed upon our asses. But I get to eat. I have a uh, Chipotle Caesar wrap. It's got a Chipotle ranch. 
lettuce, tomato, chicken. That's about it. Simple. Delicious. Are you getting the collector's edition of Elden Ring? I managed to snag. Uh, this is not through Bandai or anything. I just managed to naturally snag one from Best Buy. The premium one that comes with the helmet. So I will have the helmet. <laughs> that will probably not show up until the 25th, I would guess. I'm actually not sure. Not sure. Uh, oh, um, oh, this might suck. I may die here. This kind of just RNG. Luck of the draw, sort of. Yeah! Yeah. Yeah, that's it. <clears throat> Should have gotten the uh, transient curse. Oh, I'm all the way over here. Why are we here? We're going to drain New Londo. We're going to get Titanite chunks. We're going to get the very large ember. And we're going to get this guardian tail whip to plus 15, which is going to add about three damage uh, to probably our like 60 damage that we'll deal to the. Um, Sanctuary guard guardian, but you know, uh, <clears throat> it is what it is. Do you know what the launch time slash short stream time will be for ER? The launch time for Elden Ring is 5 p.m. Central Time. I will be streaming it Thursday. Wildebeest, eight months. Welcome back. Um, Shadows Rain as well. Gonna go melee only considering locking the weapon class. Make it to where I have to swap weapons slash weapon class after each boss. Or only let myself use starting gear. The classy run that, um... That E and B is all about. Uh, classy souls. I think... I don't remember if he didn't level anything and just used the starting equipment. Because that, that's rough. If he just used the starting equipment but you can level weapons and stuff, then it's not bad. I will be doing a light knight build. Light night build. You can level. Wait, what about your weapons though? I mean, like, can you upgrade weapons as well? Light night. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, I didn't get the transient curse shit. Oh, but I can get the shortcut ladder so I don't have to run through this garbage again. You don't need to let me know that, but enjoy your time with Elden Ring, Hatsune. Are we still drinking every time you say it? Yes. Taking a shot, specifically, remember? Heal! Now let's get the shortcut this time. Do you guys remember this in old Dark Souls used to lag horrendously when you kick this ladder. That's no longer the case. Thank you, Dark Souls Remastered. I think it is more noticeable on con on consoles and stuff, but... Okay, so the reason that we're getting the transient curse here is that um, the ghosts will fully pierce all armor and defenses if you're not cursed or have a transient curse active. You can get cursed by um, basilisks and then you have permanent ghost fighting capability which is cool. Um, so if I pop, let's say, pop a couple twin humanities for extra defense I've got some decent armor on um now if I pop this, my armor will actually block. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so it doesn't guarantee that I'm going to get up by any means, but it will give me more defense, right? I don't have a lot of stamina. They could knock me off. 
but it looks like I'm not even gonna get hit this time, so that's typically how it goes, you know, you over-prepare and then you don't run into any... Yeah, that's... Uh, that was, uh. Hello. Thanks. Bye. Zero poise, yeah. Was 8 FPS Blighttown a thing? Uh... I don't know if it was 8. I would say like 15, maybe. I don't know. Oh. Owie. Almost owie. Blighttown ran worse if you were female. Hi. Oi. Who's zapping? Dr. Ninbos. Two years. Welcome back. So hyped for Elden Ring. Yes. That is me when Elden Ring launches, baby! Sploosh! So many liquids. I'm gonna need several towels. Several towels. Uh... So many towels. Six years of backup. Six years? Oh god. Oh god. Wait, do I still have it active right now? You are an idiot! Die along with your stupid ghost child! Yeah, I knew you were in there. Sorry, that's rude, but it's what I wanted to say to that ghost at that time. And I meant it. Holy shit, I just realized! We passed 400,000 followers on Twitch.com. We are now at 400,010. It has been an age since we last hit a milestone, that 300k. Damn. Thank you guys all for following. You may now unfollow uh, so that uh, everything that I've just said is rescinded and inaccurate. Oh, God. Look, there's one of my unfollowers now. Okay. Thank you, guys. If Elden Ring weren't so imminent, I would do, like, a celebration stream. We're, all we're, oh, we're already going to be celebrating plenty with Elden Ring. Uh, can I hit past his dark hand, actually? Since it goes past shields? No! Wow. Huh. Yeah, but that's nutty! I can't even count to four... Yes! To 40, let, let alone 400,000? Wow. Nuts. All the ring is a celebration of anything happening this week. It's a celebration of everything. Bye! Well, actually, I, I do want to, you know... Fuck, this weapon is so bad. <laughs> oh, that hitbox, man. All right. All right, when I get to my, my HEMA classes, I'm going to have to ask them about that tactic where you swing and then you activate your hitbox. Because that would throw off any opponent, right? Um... Crystal Amphibian, 47 months. Welcome back. Thank you for the resub. Again, I never put any real um, forethought until my uh, into my runs until I'm doing them. And doing that would make things go a lot more smoothly. For example, if I was like, okay, at some point I'm going to get the Guardian Tail Whip, 
and I'm going to want it to be plus 15, so I should probably clear New Londo Ruins when I have a good weapon. But I just prefer to run into these issues on the fly and find solutions to them. Because then, uh, you know, we could be a little more interactive with you guys if I'm if we work together to find ways through it. Armored Bear, nine months to rule them all. Welcome back. Vestial, two months. You're always watching. Creepy. Amadeo, 90 with a fresh prime sub. Dini Pants and Crystal Amphibian resubs. Look at all these sub sublers. I need... Where did I die? I died back here. Oh, I haven't even been through the fog. Well, I don't want to do that yet then. Hold. There's not much to work with, though. While that is true, I just mean in general, not for this specific run. Oh, God. Dude, all the delayed hitboxes here. Oh. I saw the... I saw the whip in the air for a moment, and I thought it was a dog corpse. I have the other guy coming now. I almost got hit by the exact same thing. I really should dodge left. Okay, all right, all right, dudes, all right, dudes, all right, all right, all right. Okay, all right. Bye. I used a firebomb on the gargoyle tail axe uh, to acquire the gargoyle tail axe. I used black firebombs to kill Asylum Demon, so we did not use any equipped weapon for any bosses. We rolled Thief, and we took black firebombs, so we still had the master key. Because thieves are masters of unlocking. Imagine this weapon is the last day of Omit. <laughs> oh, more like, oh, I quit. <clears throat> Oh, I haven't started Neth Animal. I was going to, but then at some point, uh, Bloody and I signed up for it. But then she had a, an operation done, and she had a lot of recovery time. And then they reclosed due to COVID, so it's just been a lot of, like... But yeah, it was going to be the... That. <clears throat> the that. We've got the very large ember. And we also have 17 men all chasing us to our deaths. So I need to do a little bit of corner shenanigans. Oh, that's not gonna work with this man's. That's not gonna work with that man's. He came from a different way. Hold on, come over here, guys. Guys, come over here. Over here. Okay, let's add in another. Yeah, 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 make it a party. Add another, another. Okay. Yeah, yeah how many is this now? Four, five? I don't know. But, uh, you guys, yeah, you'll go from there. Good, 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 good. Okay, now. Now, my mans. Two at a time, that's good, yep. Yep, just get on through. There's, oh, not quite another one. Almost. Now, I don't get to grab their loot, which sucks, but I do get to survive if I do this, which is good. Survival helps. But when accomplishing objectives, or... Ah! Damn it, that other guy did not fall. Why do we fall, Mr. Rain? Oh my god. You're, you're not... Oh no, this is bad, this is bad. There we go, there we go, there we go, yeah. This is a corner I've used for so many years. Uh-huh. Yeah, no. Come now. What? And I'll kill the last one because I want the chunk, right? I, I don't want him to just drop it into the... Ah, oh, he's going to follow up. You want to see me do this in Zero League to hear the commentators freak out? Yeah, that'd be fun. For all five of my kills. Hello. Don't kick me. Oh, yeah. Oh, the stagger. Yep, 
Give me a chunk for all my efforts. No? All right, fuck you. <laughs> all right. I'm not number one in Omit, but thank you for your support, Crystal Castless, regardless. We have not used whips in the Omit League, no. to get that hitbox and he could have comboed me to death and that would have sucked but he didn't shame on you my friend holy shit I usually parry these guys but I can't repulse so <laughs> CBD is number one back in the number one spot as they were for the longest time We've still got Black Knights to go kill in the Asylum. Oh, that's for Red Titan. I changed their mind. The uh, Black Knights to kill in the Parish. As well as the Berg. Ah. The um, next, next Zero Hit League. The final Zero Hit League day is Wednesday. Not tomorrow, but the day after that. So, uh, tune in if you don't want to see how it all winds up. I don't care. They're going to kill me, but I got all the chunks and shit, so. You can dive in exclamation point leaderboard. Did CBD do well, that well last time? Yes. CBD, in order to get to where they are, had to get the least number of hits and win. And they did. And now the only way that I could possibly win is if I have a perfect six gate, zero hit game, and CBD loses and gets zero gates. Because then I would be, I would have the tiebreaker. But that's not happening, don't worry about it. That's not happening. Um, unless they decide to give Ain the point. Point. So you're saying there's a chance. Exactly. Just like the movie Dumb and Dumber. <clears throat> yep. And then the final match, our final match will be Lobos versus Hob, which is honestly like the only thing that's really going to be up in the air as far as the top spots anyways. Is who comes in second, who comes in third. And I have three omits for Hob, but there could be a curse. I had I was nerfed and had omits yesterday, but I still won my match. However, handicaps generally make me stronger. Uh, let's see. Uh, am I grabbing anything else down here? Oh no, I was just gonna grab my souls, I guess. I don't know why I came back to any. Hubby Flubby, four months. Welcome back. Also looking forward to Elden Ring. Hello. Hmm. With all the humanity I have built up, I really should farm these guys for chunks, huh? I need, um... Is it 1122? Oh my goodness. Probably 1122, so I need six Titanite chunks. We can get two from Black Knights. And uh, how many do I have? Oh, I have five. Oh, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let us get out of here. Oh, how do I get out of here? <laughs> Fuck. All right, let's go. Um, I don't have a homeward bone, do I? No. 
I don't need the humanity though, and I don't need the. It's fine. That's fine. Get me out of here. It's seven chunks. Okay, well we've got Black Knight Greatsword Knight, and we've got Sword Black Knight in the uh, Berg. So that is fine. Yes, 28 int, yes, but we're also going to get all of the souls from the DLC bosses and level with those. Uh, also, if I'm missing any optional bosses, which I guess I'm not. We did Priscilla, we did Gwendolyn, we did Capra, we did Gaping. Like, those are the ones that I never hit because they're totally out of the way. Double teamed by the Dark Boys. Butterfly we killed as well. Oh, you know what? Stray Demon, we did not kill. We did return to the Asylum, but we didn't kill Stray. Oh, hush. Oh, hush. Oh, hush. Uh, Black Knight. Yes. Near the Watchtower. Look at this damage. This is great on the starter enemies in the game. <laughs> uh, the enemies with the least defenses, right? <laughs> now. Wow, this weapon is really strong, isn't it, though? Isn't it amazing how weapon in this... Oh, and we're going to kill Pinwheel, too, after we get this upgraded. That is so we can get... Um... Oh, oops. Uh, that, yeah, yeah, okay, there we go. That is so we can get the bonfire kindled. Wait a minute. Did a non-spear boy aggro? Oh wait, hold on. So hold on. I should be able to go through his shield, right? No, I didn't. I thought whips go through shields. Is it only PvP? Is it only PvP? Oh, it's not that they go through shields. It's because they, they can't be parried. That's what it is. Oh, something else goes through. Whoa, what, what am I doing? They can't be parried. That's the difference. What do you mean, why a tail whip run? <laughs> For fun, have you seen all the runs we've done? And this is the one you're asking about? <laughs> oh. Not, oh, Lobos, why a skull lantern only run? Oh. There we go. Don't have to parry them, they deal no damage. Wow. Wow. Alright. Lobos, why not why a Kirk Thorn Armor roll only run? Why did you try a karmic justice only run? Wait, where am I going? Oh, that was where I was going. So the other one would be uh, the Black Knight Greatsword Knight in the tower. We'll go there. Lobos, why did you try a maggot kick only run? We did not do that run, by the way. It's, um, it sucks. It's awful. Spalis, 22 months. Welcome back. Running backwards only run win. We did a running man run where my character was always forced to be running forward. And I just had to, like, deal with it. Uh-oh. Well, look who's still here. Oops. What's the weapon? Terrible. I'm not, I don't even want to tell you what it is so that you never have to experience it. Maggot Kick does very low damage, but a lot of stagger. It's true. It does like eight damage on a gargoyle. However, every single hit on a gargoyle does stun. You know, I I would be down to try that run again just because we have things like Sin Skip and other things that could help. I don't see it going very far, though. The problem is... I guess it's not a problem. Like, if I fail the kick input, then I would hit with my right-hand weapon. But if it's a punch, it's not going to deal more damage than that.
No, you're never getting remotely reasonable damage. Yeah, the question is, do you need remotely reasonable damage to get through Dark Souls? That is the question that that run would answer. Which, I guess we've kind of already done in other ways, but... The answer is yes. <laughs> Just kidding. Hiya! Oh my god. Right, I can't just backstab you. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. Hey, bud. What? Interesting. Um... Yeah! Do I have any souls to pop? Oh god, not really. I was just thinking that about iframes on successful parry. I think during that animation as the enemy's being parried, you may have iframes for a brief moment. That's why I was like, what? Um, yeah, you can parry his uppercut swipe. The golf swing. Swift chamois. Uh, and I come in for the guardian tail lull. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you do. Oh, we need to go kill Stray for a Titanite Slab, so that actually works out. Actually, oh, I can warp. I don't need to, like, go over there first. Hold on. Didn't both get parried? No. What weapon are you using? What's the vile thing? Alright, fine. It's the Guardian Tail from Sanctuary Guardian. It's terrible. Don't use it. <clears throat> don't look at it. Don't sniff it. Don't Acknowledge it. Just let it die. Don't... Well, lick it if it's dirty. We already went over this. Uh, it does have... Po Is it poison or toxic? That's just poison, huh? Wait! <clears throat> Me... Maybe, uh, yeah, I think it's poison. All right, everything's coming together. Everything's coming together. We're about ready. All right, we're going to get our slab. We're going to upgrade, and finally, we're going to be going to the DLC and into the uh, toughest, probably most boring part of the run. What is happening? Oh, wrong way. <laughs> Sit on that hollow. Hollow face sitting. Five bucks an hour. Look. Yeah, look at that damage, baby. Yeah. Holy shit. One of the hollows is squishy. Yes. I can't believe how effective this weapon is. The baseline for whip damage in this game is just... The Shotol cannot be parried. I mean, blocked. That's the one that goes through shields. Dun -dun. Is he poisoned? I think he's poisoned. Yeah, he is poisoned, so there's at least that. Can you see the poison tick? On the health bar? It's moving, see? It was at that line, now it's like more than halfway. It's almost to the next line. It might in its entirety deal as much damage as an R1 from this weapon? Okay, maybe an R2. Da -da -da. Let's see how much damage this does. Wow, 40 more damage. Running attack is faster and better. Less stamina. I use an Xbox One controller. 
I think poison wear off. Oh no, I didn't. Poison lasts a long time in Souls in Souls One and Toxic, but it's a very slow burn. Hey, I get I got hit by Demon Fire Sage twice in Omit League. The rules are different, sort of. Which is basically Stray Demon. They're pretty much the exact same boss. Devade 450, 25 months. Welcome back. It was a tough situation though, backed up against the wall, and I didn't I didn't think I had time to run out the front. And the only way I normally dodge is behind. So yeah. We get a lot of back jumping. Alright, give me that slab. That's gonna give us like two extra damage. Woo! Oh, and a Homeward Bone. Praise the sun. Fire Sage has this thing. Boom. But that wasn't the problem. Undead. Oops. Undead Paris Hilton. Let's go. This is not the last weapon of the run. There are two more weapons to go. The next one will be Calamite's Tail. <clears throat> And then after that will be the Moonlight Greatsword from Seath. I believe whips have plunging attack. Actually, that's a very good question. I'm not sure it does. Oh, no, 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 no. Not back to plus five. Plus 11. Oh, one, one, two, three. Yeah, you, were, you guys were right. Nice. Very nice. It will feel great to not use this weapon again. As soon as we get that... Uh, honestly, the only thing I'm dreading is Guardian Sanctuary and Artorius. Uh, oh, I didn't even get a... Oh, I did get a bonfire. Okay. What's the strength scaling? Zero. It only has deck scaling. That's it. C dex scaling. Which I don't have very much of because we've been having to use all sorts of other stats during this run. I think we can buff it? I... Oh. I don't even have any buffs. It doesn't matter. It's It'll be a really long fight. The buff will last like 5% of the fight anyway, so... C at 15. Whee! Not at all worried about Calamite's tail cut, no. All right, I'm fighting you normally now. Tail versus tail action! Ah, oh, shit. Hot tail on tail action. Oh, that's not bad, actually! Holy shit, I'll take that. That's reasonable. That's not bad. Okay, that's fine. Lightning? No? Oh. A rolling attack. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And you can get a counter hit if he's jumping away. Ah, I didn't. No, sir! Don't ask. Ah. Ah. 
I don't. Okay. Oh, giving us the win, huh? That was not bad at all. Okay, easy. Oh, we didn't do pinwheel. Let me get sanctuary and we'll go do pinwheel. RTSR for Artorias. You know what? Yes. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. I know Artorias well, and I should absolutely be able to zero hit him, no problem. And that'll be faster and more damage. It's just all around good. Yeah, easy. No problem. We've got it. I've got an RTSR set up for it, no problem as well. More intelligence. 28 for uh, Moonlight Greatsword. We're almost there. We should have the rest of the stats, yeah. I could buy uh, Gold Pine Resin from from her, but screw that. That process will be engoodened by 69%. Hmm. Mm hmm mm hmm Already such a fun fight, why not drag it out? It's already dragged out by using this weapon. So it's going to be even more fun because I can't get hit. Plus it's dragged out. Did I eat already? No, I've just stared at my wrap here the whole time. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> I'll take this off. Yeah. Yes, you can use resin on this weapon. Which honestly would have been better than I expected. But it's the the DLC bosses are all resistant to magic damage anyways, so. The help would be minimal, but it would be help, right? It's better than nothing, but it's just not going to do very much. Gate closed. Wish we had Flynn's Ring in DS1. Perhaps in Nightfall we'll have some sort of equivalent. <clears throat> yeah, I was going to do Pinwheel for the Estus. We're going to have to do them anyways. But we just might not do them with the Sanctuary Guardian tail. Oh, wait. Whoops, 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 whoops. Forgot my RTSR setup. Which is... Old speedrun strats. <clears throat> Coming in clutch. I'm going to open the shortcut, just in case you never know. Never know. Mm. Let me pee before I do this, because I have to pee. Be right back. Okay, okay, okay. All right. My friends, Elden Ring. Not much longer to go now. Three days, one hour, 51 minutes. Until 
uh, at least until it releases on Steam for me. I don't know if that's the same across the board. Probably, right? I don't <clears throat> yeah, finish the run with Moonlight Greatsword. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Why is the timer wrong? Because it's just a website that some dude made. And I'm just capturing that website. It was right until we learned the exact hour that it came out. All you could guess early is midnight on that day, right? So. Here we go. Let's see. Dodge R1 is decent. So we'll be good. It's got range on it. That's the thing I was worried about. Oh my god, that was what I got hit by yesterday. <clears throat> ah, so much for range. Oh my god, what? See, I don't see that coming for some reason. Splunk. <gasps> Thought he was going to buff. Nah, I, I could probably bust him, but there's no need to. Stop that! It's okay, he's letting me see it a bunch. That's the only attack that really throws me off in this fight. <laughs> Slap. Jump it! Yomp it! You gonna charge up again? No. Sometimes he does. Yeah, there he goes. <laughs> Roll attack is quick, yeah. Yeah, Artorias is super predictable. I mean, it, everything is predictable to a point, and then there's things that aren't predictable, but you know exactly what the different options are. And then you figure out, you know, how to handle each. And then at that point, you're just playing out like a script in your brain. If see this, do this, and that's all there is to it. It's work, but it's not really that hard. It's just time and effort. As anything is, Jesus Christ. Also not looking at chat. <laughs> oh, again? All right. Actually, uh, I, I think I'm doing this. We'll see, we'll see if it, how it turns out, but... Um, I got hit up to do like a... A kind of in-depth guide video for the first Elden Ring boss. And, uh... It's pretty cool, just like, uh, they, they wanted to sponsor it, so... Well, go breathe, go do it again. So it'll be interesting. I'm probably going to spend a good amount of time just testing around and trying to get it to a point where I can explain it like I can something like this, you know? I can be like, I'm behind, so Artreus has a chance to do one, two, or three as move possibilities, and then you have to react to it this way, and this way, and this way. Maybe they saw the, uh, Lawrence. Was it Lawrence? What else? We did... We did a couple of, like, tutorial videos. GG! 
Is there going to be any chance you're going to do boss guides for the official guide like Bloodborne? Well, I haven't been asked uh, for Elden Ring, and it's probably already done at this point. Uh, it's usually done ahead of time. Yeah, Kingsfield with Waypoint is tonight. I'll be recording that. I don't know if it... Is it a live podcast? Or is it... It's, I mean, it's probably pre-recorded, but... In any case. <clears throat> that'll be tonight, so that'll be fun. Okay, there's two more intelligence, one more with a soul. Yep. Not live? Okay. Yeah, we're recording that tonight. I don't know if it's Future Press. Oh, was it Prima for Sekiro or something? Oh, really, Chid Ghost? No way. Awesome. Yeah, I know. It was super late that I got around to, like, doing a guide thing for uh, any bosses, but <clears throat> to get to the point that I can explain some of these bosses just takes me a lot of time, right? And I have to sit there and either do it in a bunch of different runs or I have to sit there for hours and then try and learn and analyze here and there because I try to... I try to learn bosses 100%, right? So I know all the situations and can handle them. But unlike this guy, um, that takes a lot of time. But we'll see if I get started on Elden Ring early. I'm sure it'll get be a lot more popular because uh, the game's not been out for five years or whatever. All right! Like I did with Bloodborne. hey -o. The naked dudes are the most dangerous? It's true. It's true. You see a knight in full armor coming at you, you're like, oh man, he's got to protect himself from something. You see a naked dude? Dark Souls 3 uh, next to Firelink, the katana bro? You're like, oh shit! This guy knows what he's doing! What now what? I cannot, I cannot, Lothric. Oh, Jesus! Stop it. Stop it. Double stop it. Triple stop it. Hmm. Pressed key. Ah! I almost hit the Mimic, too. That would've sucked. Woken him up a bit early. Ugh. Oh, there you go. Hmm. Oh. Boy. Nice. I'm using the worst weapon in the game, probably a guardian. Guardian. Tail. It's a whip from the Sanctuary Guardian. Don't use it ever. The end. It's not literally the worst, but it's pretty darn bad. Let's see. Plunge attack. Test. Nope. No plunge. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Some kind of mimics in Elder, I'm sure. But don't ask too many leading questions like that. People might know the answer and be like, oh, yeah. Well, you see, in the uh, scientist domain on level three, on the third door of the ru That's exactly how I talk if I'm talking about Dark Souls, so. Um. Uh oh, shit. No, there's two of them, though! Okay, it's alright, I got a shortcut. Wait a minute! Oh, this is actually fine. I have the crest key. I don't want to go here yet. I guess getting the backstab would. I mean, the bonfire would have been fine. This is unmodded, yes. Now we're gonna go get the Calamite Tail. And our pain will come to an end. Ooh, did I say I would do a video like that, Lavos? That would be cool. And we didn't really count the bosses you can access. Okay, really quickly. Dark Souls 1, out the gate after you kill Asylum Demon. How many bosses can you access? We have, including with glitches. So, Pinwheel. Uh, okay, I guess not going. Wait, hold on. Okay. Pinwheel. Iron Golem, you can glitch to. Capra. Quellag. Gargoyles. Moonlight Butterfly. Sif. Um. S s not ceaseless. Uh, oh wait. No. No, not ceaseless. 
Uh, Taurus. What are other regular ones? Stray Demon. That's nine. Pinwheel Glitch. I didn't say Pinwheel was a glitch. Four Kings. No, not ONS. You have to go through Iron Golem to get to ONS. Um... Uh, Gwyn, you need to ring both bells before you can get to him. I think I did say... I said Sif. Can't go to Four Kings after you kill Sif. You can. I guess it's... Hmm. I guess that one doesn't count. I guess Four Kings doesn't count. Um, Gaping is behind Capra. There might be a glitch to get down into depth early, but I don't know of one. Ceaseless can be accessed with death cam skip Quellag. Okay, shit. Clive Pinwell, Ground four, four Kings. See, Four Kings, yeah. I mean, I counted Four Kings in the past when I would think about this sort of thing. The point is, there's a lot of fucking ways you can go. And uh, areas to visit and items to get, and it's awesome. That's why I love Dark Souls 1 the most. That's why I like it the most. Oops. Uh, oh yeah, okay. Even beyond that, though, there's more paths. Oh, I didn't go see Calamite yet. There's, like, more paths. Like, like, beyond first boss kill, that opens up even more. Like, you could kill Quellag, and then you can do the <laughs> elevator glitch down and plunge into Demon Fire Sage. And, uh... Are you past the Lord Vessel Gate at that point? I think you are. You can death cam to the depths, use it on your pyro runs to get to the vendor early. Yeah, it's just like, it, it, unintentionally or intentionally, there are so many awesome ways to approach a Dark Souls 1 playthrough. Um, <clears throat> finding I don't have to do Blight Town from depths entrance was actually huge. Right? Right? Uh... Fire Sage, Plunge Attack, Work, and Remaster. I believe so, yeah. I... I believe so. Yeah. No, oh, wait. Actually, I don't know about that. That's a good question. After Iron Golems, you can skip Archives Gold, Golden Gate. Really? Dude, see, these are new skips that I don't... I didn't even know about. More, like, Death Cam skips? Uh, can all skips be done on console? Um, yes? Yeah. Hey, ow, fuck. Yeah, that's what I'm really intrigued by with Elden Ring as well, just to see what is possible as far as, you know, out of ordering stuff. Don't fall on my head. Bye. Absolutely, I plan to speedrun Elden Ring. Whatever that means. Fire Sage Plunge doesn't work in DSR? Oh. I mean, the plunge works, but the skip, the elevator skip, I think is what you're saying, doesn't work, right? If you could get above Fire Sage, theoretically, it would. Uh, actually, that's confirmed by McSwoozy when he did it on the zero hit run when Demon Fire Sage replaced Hydra and he plunged from the top of that ladder. That was epic. That was epic. <clears throat> what the? Try dropping into Four Kings with Death Cam Glitch. Hmm. I have not, that's for sure. Yes. Yes. I thought as much. It's called Calamite. Hold on, needs more base. Versus dragon indeed. Even mighty Anna Londa dared not provoke his ire. I see little good coming from this, but my intent is to persevere to the bitter end. Hi! <laughs> base cannon. Good, good. What is bravery without a dash of recklessness? I've taken a liking to thee. Anybody subwoofers? I owe thee much for thy service to Artorius. Okay, sorry, sorry. Now, watch and sing sorry. out golf and dragons. Okay. Look at my character's dumb face. 
I'm like a bewildered child, like... Okay, Daddy. I'm not saying children are dumb. I mean, they are, before they learn stuff, but... It's okay to be dumb. I... Look! Cool cutscene! If only I had Lobos SFX on right now. <clears throat> because we actually did that whole cutscene and it's great. Uh, alright, nice. Let's get out of here. A true shot was never lose. What's the best sound in Dark Souls 1 besides the parry? Oh, well, you took away the best sound. What, do I, what am I supposed to do with that? What am I supposed to do with that? <clears throat> I'm going to do another RTSR setup in order to help us get Calamite's tail. It doesn't change anything with the strategy. You'll just take a couple more hits without the boosted damage. You know, you could pop power within. You could put a resin on. Um, you could just have a powerful weapon and it only takes one hit to get the tail. I will show you though. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Eren is here. 11 months. Welcome back. Three days left. <clears throat> Laze Dog. Agent Splunker. Welcome back. Do, 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 dum, 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 ha. Rum, bum, bum, bum. <clears throat> All right, so you take that. Wait, is this right? Uh, I think I leave it on. I think I leave it on. And then I do this. Then I take it and swap it. Yeah, there you go. All right. The key to Calamite's tail is the swoop. Stay ranged. If, there you go. You dodge to the left. You dodge to the right. You walk away. He slams the tail. You hit the tail. And that's all there is to it, my friends. Let's try it again. Give us that swoop. Give me that swoop. No swoopies. Swoop my ass. I'm up against the wall, so he probably won't swoop. He attack. <clears throat> He's getting a little close. So we bait and attack. Just to get the swoops happen more quickly. You don't need to do any of this. The further away, the better. Swoop me mommy. No, not that. I might not have enough room now. It is a bit based on him wanting to do the swoop. But once you get the swoop, it's very consistent. And you can just keep running away and that'll get you into roughly a safe zone. There you go. You dodge to the left, you dodge to the right. He slammed that tail. You hit the tail. You missed the tail. You missed the tail. Or you hit it. Ideally, you hit it. Hitting it is recommended. <clears throat> this is fine. Keep running. Oh, where the fuck am I running? My bad. But see, we've already hit him twice. Ah, it's supposed to be. I thought we were going to get it that first time, though, because the damage is not bad. It's also a good way to get free damage on Calamine, at least when he has a tail. There you go. Dodge to the left. Dodge to the right. Slam that tail. Hit that tail. Tail get. Swap to new weapon, because it's way better. That's it. It is a tutorial. That's the Calamite tail song.
Now you know. And knowing is half the battle. I will not do that attack with RTSR. Dodge to the left, dodge to the right. He ain't got no tail. So he's stupid. He's not stupid. It's okay to be stupid. This is the best attack for him to do, for you to counter. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't like this. That's the best attack right there. <clears throat> That unupgraded RTS darn it. You know, that's actually not doing. He's going to do the grab. Watch. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, best attack right there. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy, that's bad. Okay. Dodge to the left, you dodge to the right, his tail is gone, so you're good for the night. Or something like that, I don't know. I will not do that with the ATSR. Active, my friend. Do something else. Stop doing that. Thank you. Wow, it's the first time he's done that this, this round. All right, start to get away. Start to get away, because I don't like it. Stop it! Get your stupid beak out of here. You gonna grab ya? Blah. Uh-oh. You gonna fly? Yeah. See, I just know the patterns. Whoops. <clears throat> when you do it enough, you recognize what he's gonna do before he even does it. Uh, with some certainty. Rip your ears, I'm sorry. Well, let's die. Calamity ring. Uh, I want those souls. I don't have a homeward bone. I should have. Mm, best ring. No, it takes a while to go in. I don't have a homeward bone, so I gotta. All right. Gotta run back to use them. <gasps> Convergence mod devs tweet that the mod is now complete. And uh, if you didn't know, I have a suggestion box below the, the stream that I absolutely do look at. Have yet to pick a title there, but the one at the top is Dark Souls 3 Convergence mod. <laughs> I do not need the slab, no. Uh, we're not really, I think, going to be upgrading anything. It's fine. It's... Um, dog it. Dog it. Dog it. Mm. Good fell. Eight months. I'm already looking forward to your Elden Ring runs. Got to play it myself first, though. Enjoy. Enjoy. This is a this is a rare time for us as Soulsborn Kiro fans. Um, unless you don't like one or more of those, in which case, whatever. But since I got into the Souls series, I've only been here for Dark Souls Two, Bloodborne, Dark Souls Three, Sekiro. Four releases. That's it. In the, I don't know, nine years that I've been playing Dark Souls. So, I mean, yeah, that's a lot. Whatever. But, you think about it. 
Rare occasion. Rare occasion. DLCs, yeah. But uh, this is like a whole new game, right? 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 We don't even. Oh, I don't. I don't even know if any of the systems are gonna be the same, or how. What? I just don't know. Mind Collective, two years. Welcome back. Like how Sekiro, right? Sekiro was a FromSoft game, but it was totally different. And uh, yeah. Rare. Bloodborne was a, a treat as well. My goodness. Goodness. It's almost here. I can smell it. Smell it. Like yesterday's underpants. Oh. Why, streamer? What happened yesterday in the underpants? Well, I pooped. Ah! Don't you dare. Oh, yeah, I died doing this. I forgot. What do you think the worst smelling area in all of Soulsborne? I think, honestly, the one with, uh... The... <clears throat> at the very bottom of Yorm's area with the poop spider mommies is... has got to smell awful. I think, I think that probably smells even worse than Black Gulch, because I don't really, I don't know. Like, it's gross, but it's, it's like poison stuff, which probably is toxic to smell and not pleasant. But does it smell, like, particularly bad? I don't know. Bloodborne Ludwig room covered in blood probably smells pretty bad, too. Oh, I had the shortcut. <laughs> Whoops. Is Elden Ring the game you know the least going in for the first time? The least since Bloodborne, really. Oh, whoops. Because... Bloodborne, all the knowledge I had was that leaked Project Beast trailer. If you guys remember that. If you don't. I think that's the only thing that I remember. Ah, there might have been. I'm sure there were trailers and stuff. There was an official trailer, right? Um, maybe it was the intro to the game. I don't remember what all they showed. But there really wasn't a lot known, I think, when we first went into it. I could be wrong. But it, it was, um, excuse me. Excuse- what are these stored rolls for years? Bloodborne is goaded, dude. Did you guys see the, um, the gif that, uh, fuck, dude, I'm so bad with names. What's his name? Who does all the gifs of all the fighting games and stuff and really cool. He made one for Bloodborne. And, uh, oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay, bye. Sir, sir. Sunhi Legend, that's right. Yes, uh, did one for Bloodborne. Uh, Lawrence, yesterday, kind of weaved in some lore and stuff. Haha, <laughs> Lawrence. <laughs> yeah, that was good. Is that the only chained prisoner in the game? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Mm hmm. What have you seen from Elden Ring? The first thing that I... The only thing I've seen from Elden Ring was the reveal trailer. The gameplay kind of reveal trailer at... People were telling me it's Summer Game Fest. Where we first got to see, like, some meat of Elden Ring. Was that t last year or... When was it? I don't know. Uh, I did not watch any network test. I did not see any other videos wait of course you do that um yep the Jeff Keeley trailer the initial uh reveal there after that point I went totally dark on it uh okay here we go man <clears throat> 
Man is catalyst. Man is catalyst. Man is catalyst. Man is catalyst. <laughs> he took no damage from that grate. Hello. This is my favorite boss to fight in the game. Just the, the most satisfying, I think, for me personally. Da 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 Slap. Thank you, muscle memory, for remembering that. Ooh, that was a little early. Whoa. Earlier than I normally go. In the spell shit. No matter. No matter. Finish him with R2. I'll assume it does about the same amount of damage as an R1. Whoa, that was early as well. Jesus, scary. Bum, bum, ba ba da bum, bum, ba 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 bum, bum. Okay. You idiot! God damn it! How much stamina does that use? <laughs> also, long ass build up. Okay, I'll do it one more time. I'm only gonna do that R2 though during where when he does a magic. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. It's not a stupid game. That's a swag game, okay? It's stupid until it goes right. Then it's amazing, all right? X Remchak, four months. Welcome back. Resnick, Mind Collective, Goodfell. Yeah, I think I got you guys. Thank you so much. What's the runabout? This is a tail weapon only run. Must use tails when they are encountered. Must cut, must tail. We only have one more tail in the game after this. That is Seath. This is the final DLC boss. Um, we will get Seath's Moonlight Great Sward. <clears throat> Ugh, all that effort for nothing, man. I did collect scales in Ash Lake. Yep, we actually upgraded one of the weapons. Oh, Priscilla's Dagger, yeah. It's not a big deal, though. As you can see, we're doing the DLC with an unupgraded weapon, so it's not going to be an issue. It won't be an issue. Oh, shit, that's not right. <laughs> that impact sound. <clears throat> Felt early again. Yeah. 
getting greedy. Magic? No. Crumbles. Crunchies. Really double? Interesting. Don't kill, don't kill, don't kill. Alright, 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 alright. Now I just need him to do the one magic attack. Do it. That's not it. Do the magic attack. The one where you... Do the one where you suck and you blow... No. That's the only opening I trust with that R2 attack. <clears throat> nope, not that one. Close! Not quite. Not that. Certainly not that. No. I'm gonna heal, you know what? We're definitely gonna do enough damage. It's just about doing the right attack. We're waiting on you, Manus! Waiting on you here, buddy! Any moment that you would like to... No, 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 no. That's not the one. Man, this has left the game. There he goes. All right. Oh, the point down. Jesus. That was worth it. That looked awesome. <laughs> Worth. Oh, it's you. Be baptized in flame. Baptized in flame. Do we, are we missing any stats from Moonlight Greatsword? Are these enough? 34, 25, 28. Those good? Oh yeah, I married her. Like in Dark Souls 3. Created a time paradox. That's all good. And it scales with int, right? Do you... No, faith is in demon souls. Not dark souls. If it scales in int, I'm going to get a little more int. Um, S in int. Okay, I'm going all in int then. Okay. We're a smirt boy. Uh, all right. In that case... Let's get to work, shall we? We've already got... Oh. I don't... Okay. Let's get our final tail weapon. Yes, we got all the tails except for Seath. Should I have... Hmm. Dragon scales, man. Ah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Now we haven't done pinwheel yet. I was going to, but then uh, I just did 
RTSR instead. I was going to do it for the extra Estus. Do you have money put aside for therapy if e Elden Ring isn't good? No, I won't be giving any therapy sessions for you. I'm sorry. You can get nine scales without farming. We've already got a lot of the scales is the thing. We I use it to level up Priscilla's dagger. and. <clears throat> Where's the sun? This seems fake. Actually, it was the sun that was fake. Toss the whip. It's done its job. Yes, yes. Absolutely, it has. And the dagger. See, that was a lot of our... That was, what, five, five of our... Four of our scales? Oh, knock it off! Leave me alone! Okay, it will be worth it, Flint Default. Flint Default. Granted, worth it is different for everybody. Absolutely, absolutely. But... Worth it in general? It's worth it. <laughs> I, I don't need to... Uh, even if the game is for some reason horribly broken at launch, like, it'll be fixed up. It, it is an ever-changing and adapt at, uh, updating product that... I'm not trying to curse it or anything, but... <clears> hmm. <throat> Worth of me says you have bad react time and such in the content too. That's true. That's true. Uh, I believe it is going back to being much more accessible than things like Sekiro. So, uh, I mean, if... Uh, yeah. We'll find out. We'll find out, yeah. Oh, I meant to repair. Did I not repair? I did not repair. Mm, ah, 194. We're fine. Not even half. So I'm sorry. Uh, the part of me wants to know why I fell this week so I can finish it and watch streams. I also want to just enjoy it. No spoilers. Enjoy it! I was saying earlier, this is rare. It is very not often that you get a chance to experience a new Souls. Oh, yeah. There's another thing. We've been showing off a bunch of things. Here you go. Just leave. Fuck you. I know most people know that, but some I'm sure don't. Ah, this time I'm in a fight. Never mind. All right, we'll fight this time. Ah, but not. Ho! Oh. No curses! 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 All right. Oh. Uh. <clears throat> All right, well, we might as well show off more stuff. Oh no, we're in prison. We can't warp now. I can't warp now. It's too unsafe. Oh. Okay, now I'll warp. I wasn't in prison anymore. I got out of my cell, so I... Yeah. Uh... This is gonna take us back there? Okay, we're back. We're back. It's okay. We'll, we'll actually do this now. I gotta get the key. I, I gotta go through here anyway, so... <clears throat> I mean, I don't have to. Uh... Well... I mean, there's always Duke Skip. Well, ah, I don't have a good warp for that. You're actually stoked to learn about this, but haven't got a chance to exploit it yet. Yeah, it's basically there's very likely like a just a trigger, a box or something that's like while in this zone cannot warp, but then you can access the bonfire from outside that little gate on the ledge. So can warp. Can do. Yeah, I figured the bonfire would be blocked, but it must have been just easier for them to do it that other way, right?
Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, I'm gonna grab this and you kill me, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. It's faster. It's gonna warp us back up top. Predict how many people will be streaming Elden Ring on Thursday. <clears throat> streaming or viewing? Maybe it was a dev thing they forgot to fix? I'm sure they just didn't find it, and it doesn't really, it doesn't really matter. Huh? Uh, streaming? <laughs> Are you talking about, like, all streamers everywhere? I don't know. I've never looked at that metric for any game, so I don't even know what relative number would make sense. <laughs> 3,000. Howdy, sorry, crates. How do? Ah, you jalopy. Seems low. Probably. Ah, oh. Oh, oh, I can one hand it. That's right. <laughs> Beep, 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 beep. Will I what? I'm feeling you stop worrying about Elden Ring. Every game Miyazaki has touched has been amazing. Um, wait, where am I? Um, wait, where am I? Um, oh yeah, yeah, we go up. Yeah, <laughs> it's been a while since I did this. What constitutes a tail weapon? A weapon when you cut off the you get when you cut off the tail of an enemy. There are no other cuts, otherwise I would have specified otherwise. The centipede demon has orange charred ring if you cut his hand off, but weapons no. <clears throat> yes, the Drake sword is a tail weapon. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to do with bosses. The Anerlando gargoyle tail axes. Those count? Well, there's only one that drops the tail, actually. We learned. We learned. I did not know. Flame kick only after centipede. It's not a weapon. That's not... Ah, what is in my eye? There's something in my eye! Finger weapon only. Hmm. See fist only run. We did it. Uh-oh. Frame drops or is it you? I have not frame dropped in... Like, two years. It's great. Oh, so nice to have that in the past. All right. So. This weapon does fine damage. Oh, you know what I did do as a run in the past was dragon... Was it dr dragon tail weapon R2 only? I remember doing that. This has its own challenges because... I have to constantly be swapping tail weapons. I, I, there might be a YouTube of that. Yeah, people said this can be buffed. Yeah. Wait, does that mean that this is a normal up? No, it's dragon scale. Never mind. It'd be dragon scale. Um. This health. Yeah, it's fine. This health. In the middle of my health. Yeah, look at that beautiful setup, baby. Red tears all over the ring. The wrestling ring or something. This is the last tail to get. Hopefully I don't mess it up. Because then... Otherwise, then we'll be learning how to get Seath's tail without the crystal. The randomizer challenge from E10? What is E10? Is this a serious question? E10, these nuts. Of course it's not a serious question. It's... <clears throat> Wow. 
why would I ever think that soy is ever serious? Uh, <clears throat> you got me. You got me. What can I say? Um, that face, though. That looks like a horse. That person looks like a horse. Three days and one hour remain. Hello, Hanson. Oh, Eaton Winters from Resident Evil. Yeah, 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 yeah. Resident Evil 8. Well, 7, too. Uh oh. All right. That was real close. You know what? This is gonna suck. This is going to be awful. Awful. I mean, that's with red tearstone ring, don't forget. It's not as bad, but it's still, that's with Red Tearson Ring, and getting hit by little Tinkies, little Crystal Tinkies, is a mess. Ah! Yeah! No tinkies, no tinkies, no tinkies, no tinkies. We're running out of space. Ah, we didn't follow that rule the entire time about immediately having to swap weapons. I didn't start off with that, but I did change it to that kind of, I guess. Okay, nice. Room acquired. Whee! <laughs> No tinkies, no tinkies, no tinkies. No tinkies! Especially sprinting. Sprinting is counter hit, Tinkle. Yeah! Oh, oh, no tinkies, dude. This is what I want. Just this back and forth. The AoE sucks. AoE sucks. He's still gonna do a, a far away attack. Which is weird, but that's just how he works. Now he... No tinkies, no tinkies, no tinkies, no tinkies, no tinkies. Oh, am I gonna get tinkied out here? Nah. Tinkless. Tinkless. I'm gonna rotate him after this. You can kind of sit in his armpit and you'll rotate. Probably. Uh oh. Uh oh. Alright, we'll have space and then we should be good. We should be good for the rest. Tinkless. Tinkless discharge. Mm hmm. Oh, 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 oh. I meant to attack one more time, but it didn't happen. All right. All right. Nice. I didn't finish with an R2, sorry. Tinkless. Yeah, I know, and you were gonna say that, Jordy. <laughs> Even got. Oh. <clears throat> okay. 
Okay. Four Kings magic resistant. When is not magic resistant? I know that. <laughs> it gets destroyed. Yeah, four kings magic resistant. Great. No, get all the damage we can. Uh, it should be fine though. Um, all right. Let's go. Daughter of Chaos first. Magic works wonders against four kings. Um. I mean, magic does absurd damage. Like, if you're using spells. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> you monster. Ah. Did we sif yet? Yes. I bled Sif's blood all over the blood floor. And it's gone. His blood is gone. I could upgrade, but we're not really going to need to, to be honest. The thing is, I'd have to kind of go out of my way to get the dragon scales now at this point, and they would save me like, I don't know, five to 10 R1s on a boss. With RTSR, it's just not gonna be as bad. Um, I wanna kind of relearn how to ceaseless skip, because that was such a fun skip. Uh. Yeah, I tried to do a, a maggot head kick only run. It only does about six to eight damage or so, but it has incredible poise break and one maggot head attack will instantly stagger a gargoyle, which is pretty cool. Whoa, one R1 equals stagger here. You just roll off the elevator. You've done it plenty of times, bro. Roll off the elevator. Well, I... Oh, if you mean the... If you mean the save and quit thing on the elevator, that apparently doesn't work in Dark Souls Remastered. I'm talking about the Cecil skip where you walk through the lava without the orange charred ring. That one's scary. Oh, where am I going? Where am I going? Oh, my God. Boy, yeah. Blah. Go ahead and move my greatsword R2 only. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> we do zero shit league for Elden Ring. We'll find out. I don't know. In Carbono, thanks for the 71 months, by the way. Sorry, Mr. Reese, welcome back. I'm not using my Lobos S effects. Because I wanted to play just vanilla Dark Souls for the first time in like a century. No randomizer, no other mods. Like the good old days when I used to just. Hello, burn me. Burn, baby, burn. Burn me. No, 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 not that. I want to sprint into this, but I don't want to get Taurus demon Yes. Beautiful. Yeah, streaming from the couch. That's, that's old school. You stupid butt. The trick to this guy is just stay in front of him. This sucks when he does this, though. At least that's my trick. He's gonna jump back a lot. That's why I got fucked in the zero hit. He normally just flies. And then he was, you loop him like this. Oh, shit. Don't jump back, you stupid bitch. You're going to jump back. Don't do that. Attack us, then you're going to hit my ass, and then I'm going to have to reset the fight. And I 
fuck that, you stupid! How come there's so many people here today? Anticipation for Elden Ring. A nice, classic Dark Souls challenge run. I mean, it, it, it's a challenge run. Cla it's just a, I, I wanted to really just harken back to the good old Dark Souls days and just palate cleanse in preparation for Elden Ring in three days and 50 minutes. Three days. 50 minutes. 350. Let's cheese ceaseless, too. It's not my timer, but it is wrong, yes. Um, but it is, it technically it isn't correct because it just says days until Elden Ring release. Well, it'll be incorrect in 50 minutes, but... The timer was based off before we knew any sort of launch window, so don't blame them for having it a year ahead of time and it now being wrong. It's, it's been here for... We've had it on stream for like 140 days. All right. Senta cheese. We are going to want some uh, good RNG on his attacks. So let's see if he'll give it to us. This is expected. I'd like the flip attack, please. Thank you. Flip. I'd like another flip attack, if you would. Nope. That's fine, though. One flip. Could you flip? There's a flip. That's good. Now, I would like you to grab. Oh, my God. No. Nope. Uh, that's fine. Oh, I'm almost dead. RTSR setup, though. He yump. If you wouldn't mind grabbing, I'm right here. That's a flip. That's not a grab. My camera is completely broken. He's jumping. This has no tail. Uh, you can cut. Uh. I think you... Oh, wait. No. I think you can cut the tail. I think you can, actually. No weapon, though. This is perfect. All right, thank you. Um, 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 um. What do you think, horse lady? Are we done? Let's go find out. And a well-timed parry! Perfect. Imagine we got clips through the wall. Yep. Imagine. Imagine. GG. GG. I was right to trust you, horsewoman. I expected as much from thee. I didn't expect that much. Noctis Nyx, thank you for 10 gifted subs. 10 Giftingtons. Thank you. What did I put on? What did I put on? I definitely didn't put on the orange shard ring. Oh, that's... <laughs> you know, it kind of looks like it, see? I don't read. I look at the icons. And I never have the Calamity Ring in my inventory, so... <laughs> Whatever. Thank you, Noctis Nix. You are too kind. I expected as much from thee. Well, if you, if you forget to parry at the right time for that, you can just save and quit and do it again. Wolfie96 gifted a sub to Lactator. Lactator's precious. Tojorn, prime sub. Welcome to the Wolfpack. Thank you for that. 
Why take no lava damage when you can take double? Or half lava damage, maybe. Quarter lava, lava damage. Time for best boss. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, the best one. I expected as much from thee. Mr. Vacuum Brain Bimbo. Thank you for five gifted subs. <clears throat> Thank you very much. This is absolutely a tail weapon, Burton Toast. Can you cheese with projectile? Uh, I don't think so. Hacks. Are you trying to cover up that you didn't realize that Moonlight Greatsword was a tail weapon? I expected as much. What are you doing? You're. You're covering up Burton Toast's embarrassment. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Zero Rebellion. Ten gifted subs. Thank, re thank you, Zero Rebellion. I appreciate you. Lady Isleheart. Four months. Welcome back. If that resub... If it was possible, I'll... That resub has a... <clears throat> Comment. I'll heart it. Never mind. Just fuck it. I get out of here. Anyways, Bed of Chaos is a boss in the video game. Don't you dare! Oh, I gotta stagger you. Should we go surfing? Stabs McGee, 35 months. Welcome back. Oh shit, I didn't roll. Fuck. Wait, hold on. I want to see if that's consistent. Sorry. A freaking mage, four months. Welcome back. Well, not surfing, but the opposite. I want the I want the shuffle step. That's what I wanted, not the surf. Let me see. I, I don't know. I, I it happens all the time. I don't know how consistent it is. Yeah, there you go. Oh, what? Oh, it stopped. <laughs> uh, I expected as much from thee. Guys, stop. Taco Bell, four months. Freaking mage, four months. Knock this nicks. Ten subs. Ten gifts. Muesli. Uh-oh. Four months. Uh-oh. Don't get slapped, son. Woodbine with a fresh sub. Roll damage, baby. <coughs> Whoa! Whoa! Uh oh. I expected as much from you. Zadelia, 49 total months. Welcome back. Uh, five gifted subs. Gifted five subs. Thank you for that. Bepon... Beponji... Ten gifted subs. Oh my god. No! Uh-oh. Might be dead. Might be dead. Not be dead. RTSR. Oh, get the full... Get the... I'm rolling into you. That's how you die. You roll... You can do it. You can do it. Oh. There you go. <laughs> you don't have to do that at all. And then we save and quit and say, as much from the... screw your run back. Even though we can just jump back across and then go, but, um, what a, yeah, Mari makes five gifted subs. 
And a gift to Juggernaut of the D2. Salmate, welcome back. Really been enjoying the resurgence of Souls content. Thank you. Oh, yeah, we haven't even gotten started. Oh, boy. Soulsborn Keyring like. Oopsies. That's a poopsie. One. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Scope it. Wait. No beard, no beard, no beard, no beard. Beard? Okay. I, I changed because I wanted to R2 it. I purposefully missed because I wanted to R2 it. That's what I meant to say. But my brain stopped working mid start sentence. Start, start sentence, yeah. All right, let's go to Nido. Let's go to Nido. Soulsborn Keyring, yeah. Does the Moonlight Greatsword? No. Nah. Sorry, fool. You could not be the chosen. Chosen what? I'm sorry? The Moonlight Greatsword does not keep skeletons dead, does it? Yep, we got all the tails, Tua. This was the final tail weapon. Nah, yeah, it's dumb. Alright, uh... They don't really distinguish in this game between... Divine magic... Well, not in the UI or anywhere you can noticeably tell. Between divine magic and regular magic, you just... Divine weapons can kill the skellies permanently. That's it. That's it. I don't even know that the grant... I guess, can miracles permakill skellies? I feel like they should be able to? Hey! Sploosh. There's an auxiliary divine modifier on the UI. Miracles cannot. Uh, Divine Magic... Oh, it has its own modifier? Really? Uh... uh yeah. Wait, what's black? Is that Chaos? No, that's Occult. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. And then Magic Damage is up here in the numbers. Yeah, you're right, you're right. You're right. Oh, get out of here, Obsidian Grat Sward. More like Obsolidian Great Sword. Holy shit. Destroyed. Oh. Our only time you ever get a cult is a chest in Orlando. Yep. Same. Same. Uh, if you want to do divine quickly, you can get the occult weapon and un-upgrade it from Andre. You can have him de-reinforce and it will become a divine weapon plus five. Which is good for, I think... I mean, it's, it's good for that. Uh, like, if you want to kill skellies real quick. Oh, shit! Why wasn't he coming at me? That's fine. Yeah, if you just want a quick divine weapon to kill skellies, boom. Occult Club, D-upgrade. It's divine plus five. Gate closed for Lobos! <sighs> it's fucking broken. Oh, mate. Where are you going? Let's have the... Uh, let's have some fish and chips. Before you... Don't you? Alright, whatever. Gotta get the mask. Gotta get mask. Gotta get mask. Gotta get masker, masker. Masker, masker, masker. Spam detected in my email. Shit. Mommy? Oh, mommy mask, yeah. <laughs> I thought you were calling pinwheel mommy. I was like, uh. Shifty Aura. 
Thank you for that sub. Welcome to the Wolf Pack. Although technically Pinwheel is mommy and daddy and child. Oh, what the fuck? Oi da! Hey! Please no. I mean, it's true. It's true. The pinwheel lore. She's one third mommy. Yeah, but that's. I don't. Ha yeah. Am I gonna need to get. Nah, need? Nah. Am I gonna wanna get. Maybe. Well, we'll see. We'll see what happens. We'll see how it goes. It's going to be a little annoying, but shouldn't be too bad. Your mom pretty much is pinwheel. Hmm. Hmm. What? Why are we talking about breast milk? Besides mommies? Skip it! Why not? Uh, well, I think it's kind of weird, I guess. I don't... I mean, unless, like... Wait, it's relevant and makes sense in the context. Are the masks drop random? Yes. But you can buy the masks that you don't have if you don't kill patches and you interact with him all the way. Um, then he returns to Firelink as a vendor and you can buy all of the masks. And some other stuff. But who cares? No Leroy. Yeah, sorry about that. I didn't have any leeway to bring in Leroy with the, uh, how the run's going. That's not true. I got plenty of leeway. Grant is Leroy's tail drop. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, I can do this. Yeah. Have a little... <sighs> all right. All right. All right. Let's go. I expected as much from the trivia bit. If you two hand a halberd and block with it, Nito's sword attack cannot hit you. This one. Ow, fuck. But I don't have a halberd, and it's, there's no tail... It would be a tail... Would not be a tail weapon anyways. So. That's just logic, though. Is Wolfring any good? It's fantastic for PvP, that's for sure. Keep these skeletons dead in the corner of the back room. Gonna stab him. There you go. Yes, sir. Yeah! Can we see the AOE? Oh, that's not an AOE. I don't like that. Um, at least some side slashies. Yeah, to get rid of some of these skellos. No? What? 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 AOE! Yeah, yeah. No? You're not hitting them, though. You need to hit them with your damage. I would like if, if you hit them with your damage. More humanity means more defense. So I will do that. They're all dead right now. Oh, they're not. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 Shit bag. Shit bag, shit bag, shit bag, shit bag. They're not gonna die. They're not gonna die. They're not gonna die. I need to heal. Quick heal. Oh, they did die. You almost messed up my dodge, you stupid skeleton. Triple kill, kill, kill. Oh, shit! I should have looked! <laughs> oh, oh. That's bad. That's bad. Oh, that's... Okay, recovery. You want to parry me? That's what you want to do? I said no. Oh, you're parry stancing. Yeah, slash him. Ah! Jemus! Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Hit ne Nito and Skellies. Hit Nito and Skellies. Yeah. Stay over here. Stay over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Reached him. Get in there. Get in there. Yeah, whatever. Forward stab. It's fine. Nobody cares, Nito. Nobody even thinks it's Nito. Come on, kill it through the body. Kill it through the body, make the skelly go pop. Oh, just killed. Excellent. What about the Moonline Sword Art? Yeah, it's there. It's there. <laughs> I was going to when they were all rezzing. I was going to do an R2, but Nito cock blocked me by doing a melee. I was like in between Nito and the three skellies rezzing, and I was like, AoE could get them all, but I didn't, I didn't see the opportunity. If you've never seen Nito without his cloak, he pops up like that in the randomizers, and it's terrifying. Genuinely terrifying. Reset. Better make an estimation how many challenge runs have you done for Dark Souls 1? We don't need to make an estimation. There's a spreadsheet full of them. Type in exclamation point challenge runs. Now, there may be some that were not on there, but they are largely all there. Time for the full fox. Wait, why fox? Um, it's time to break this fap ring. Okay, not just yet. Oh, wait. Yes, just yet. Yes, just yet. Goodbye, fap ring. It was a pleasure knowing you. Fifty-six, twenty-eight, fourteen. All right, there we go. The four respectable gentlemen. I like that more. Um, Ma Mari makes with another gift to Ramadan. Thank you, Mari makes. Now. I'm interested to see how good this damage is. Breaking the fap ring without testing the damage may have been a mistake, but I have faith. No, I don't. I have 11 faith. I mean, that's that's still having faith. Uh, we'll see. I have int. That's what's important. Ha, <laughs> import int. Blue Raven, thank you for 27 months. Welcome back. The fat ring breaks for lore reasons, I believe, because it's Velka's assistance. And if you remove her ring, then she's like, well, fuck you. you I'm not helping you anymore again. Like, you, you're you getting rid of your vow to me and only me. Yeah. I'm inting. This is the Moonlight Greatsword. Bah. Ah, oh, shit. Why did I do that? Oh. Hmm. Oh, we'll be fine. I know that probably seemed like not a lot of damage when I took a hit. The fact is, if they hit you when you're that close, it's just a hilt hit. And their damage is garbage. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Best. Best. Bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Ba, ba, da, da, da. Oh, 
Alright, alright, we need to make some haste here. Other king? I saw you uh, pop into existence. Now we gotta do this. We gotta do this. No more RTSR, but could I, um, do you mind, like, if you hit me up close with a side swipe, that might, let's see. One more time. There you go, perfect. <laughs> Doing it live! No problem. Alright, I'm healing. Hey, Dist! What's up, Dist? Dude, three days! Three days to go. Hello. Ew. Oh, I should have killed. Alright, R2 for the win. Let's see what you got. Don't do don't back up and do magic. It is, it is soy, it really is. The fuck is dying over there? For humanity, get it? Four kings? For humanity? <laughs> when the ring breaks since you take it off of Lawtrek. Well, he knows how the ring works, and he's just really thinking about whether he actually wants to do that. That's the... how that works. I went human for our finish. Wait, are we doing... are we doing our finish? Yeah, we're doing our finish. I think that's everything. I think that's everything. I thought there were at least five kings. Well. You sorry fool. Holy shit, I never like landed on him there. Uh. You cut his finger off that has the ring and then you put your finger inside of his finger. Damn. He must have some big fingers to accommodate an entire other human finger, right? You know what they say about guys with big fingers. <laughs> oh, 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 shit. Yeah. Oh, man. They have trouble finding glove sizes that fit them. That's what they say. Um. All right. Uh, well, we're def I'm definitely putting on Hornet Ring. I think we'll just do a straight up Gwyn. Straight up, look at these stats. We did, we barely leveled any vitality endurance. I think I had nine vitality at the start. Now we got ten. Baby health, but that's okay. Lots of typos. That's true. That's true. Fat fingers of the decade. Um. It only breaks if the wearer willfully removes it. You take it off his corpse. That makes sense. That makes sense, right? That goes along with the, you know. A lower reason for why it breaks in the first place. Oops. <laughs> you type all the time and your f fingers are spindly as fuck. Well, practice more. Oops. Oh, hey, I have food. I've had food here for a while. <laughs> like two hours. This cold, dead wrap in front of me just slowly decomposing. It's fine. I'm done. I'm done now. No, nah, it's okay. I figured we were, we were not too far off. Of course, I got it when we were, like, entering the DLC, so I don't know why I thought... It's fine. I wasn't that hungry. I, I'm just only eating because I need to for my health. That's generally the only reason I eat anyways. It's pre-digestion. <laughs> You guys see the 360 parry? Might have been too fast. I understand. Oh!
Yes. Oh, okay. Go ahead. <laughs> That's fine. It's a... Uh... <clears throat> bingo, 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 bing. Prum, prum, prum. Winning. Um, <clears throat> nice. Oh yeah, this bug. This is still here. Wait, 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 wait. No, it's gone now. Oh, it was there for a second. <laughs> Walk of shame for Gwyn. Whoo. Okay. This has been my last full Dark Souls run before Elden Ring. We are here to serve your highness. Serve my Heine. Do it. What was that about could not be the chosen one, bitch? Let the true God be cast upon the world. Oh wait, that's uh Koth doesn't want that. I mean Framp doesn't want that. Koth wants that. Framp wants the cycle to continue, doesn't he? Now it's time to pull the full-time DS2 streamer card. <laughs> How many games can you speedrun with the last hour of stream? Some. Are you going away from the internet to avoid spoilers? I've been doing that for the last year. Puppy dog ear lip things. Business evangelist. Interesting title. <laughs> evangelist. I guess it's not entirely religious focus. Ah, we won. We won. We won. And that is going to do it for me today. Sorry for slight early end, but I'm going to go eat my wrap. Re relax, rest, prepare. Prepare. No stream tomorrow. Tuesday is my day off. Wednesday, the final day of Zero Hit League. Final day. Lobos versus the Happy Hob. It's going to be a battle for second, third place. And um, we'll see what happens. And then Thursday... Thursday is the day. I had to flip so it makes sense. 